Today in Minecraft, I used portal guns to prank my friend Melon. Ooh, a free diamond block. Ah, help, I'm falling into lava. Uh, what's that coming through the portal? Oh, it's a subscribe button. Press it right now. Ah, yes, finally a relaxing day away from Melon enjoying my television time. Yo, Sonny, Sonny, are you kidding me? I thought I could finally relax and enjoy my favorite show. I mean, oh, I gotta turn this off. I gotta turn this off. Yo, Sonny, what were you watching, bro? That was sus. Nothing, Melon. It doesn't matter. Don't worry about it. It's my favorite show, and it's not for you to know about. Anyways, Sonny, Quandale has this epic new thing in his lab he wants to show you. Follow me! Wait a second, Melon. Quandale's got a laboratory? Yeah, bro. How do you think he comes up with all these crazy gadgets and doohickeys? I thought he just kind of magically had them and then sold them to us. No, silly. He's a scientist. That's crazy. Yo, Sonny, we've made it. Hey, this looks so cool. Quandale's lab is crazy goaded. Hey, what's up, Quandale? Yo, he's got sheep that are changing colors. Melon, did you even notice this? Yo, how did he do this? He's a genius. But bro, he trapped a snow golem. It must be an evil snow golem. No way Quandale Dingle could do something evil. You're right. And this thing looks huge, bro. It looks like it was working out. He's got big muscles. Yo, it might be a mutant. No way. Maybe Quandale's trying to bring him back to normal and save him. Yo, you're right. Quandale, you're such a good guy. Wait a second. I wonder what Quandale keeps in this room. Uh, Sonny, he told me to tell you to not go back there, okay? He's conducting a top secret experiment and no one's allowed in there. Let me ask him myself. Quandale, Quandale, what's the deal with that room behind you? What do you mean it's off limits? So what if you're conducting top secret experiments? I could help. What do you mean I'm stupid? If I was stupid, would I steal this from him? I don't think so. Hey, let me just fist bump my friend right here. Melon, let's get out of here. Quandale's being mean to me. Wait, Sonny, we can't leave yet, dude. I've got to admire these sheep for another 10 minutes. What? Why 10 minutes? Uh, because I'm amazed by them. How did he do such a thing? Whatever. I'm gonna go talk to Quandale again. <sighs> Can I at least have some redstone lamps or something cool for decorating? Yeah, they're in the chest. Thanks, Quandale. Better than nothing, I guess. I really wanted to know what he keeps in this room, though. It must be so cool. Melon, has it been 10 minutes yet? Uh, no, it's been like one minute, dude. Uh, I got nine left. Well, you have fun staring at the sheep. I'm gonna go decorate the house a little bit. All right, yeah, have fun, man. And now to decorate. I think I'm gonna put a redstone lamp on this corner, another one over on this corner. That looks really nice for the entrance. And then when I go inside, I kind of want to remove these pegs pesky sea lanterns. They're not my favorite. And there's more in this hallway that I'm not the biggest fan of. Wait, what is that? Why are there diamond blocks in the ceiling? What's in this chest? What the heck is Melon been doing? He's got all of these resources, but he hasn't been sharing. Why is he always so greedy? Whatever. I'm gonna replace these and cover them up quickly before Melon gets home. And I'll pretend I didn't discover his secret stash of diamonds. Okay, guys, this sheep is pretty cool. I'm done now. Dude, do, 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 do. Hey, Sonny, what's up? Oh, not too much. I'm just redecorating the house with these redstone lamps. I got one more to go right here, and then I got an extra for you. Dude, that's actually really pretty. You just gotta rig them up with redstone now so we can see. Please tell me you did the wiring. Um, yeah, about that. I don't have any redstone, and I don't know how to do that. Well, now our house is dark. Good job, Sonny. I can't believe you. I'm just gonna go to sleep, man. You're so annoying. Maybe Quandil was right. Maybe Maybe I am dumb. Psych! I'm a genius! Melon doesn't even realize I know about his secret diamonds upstairs. Yes, you sleep the night off, Melon. <laughs> you sleep. Okay, guys, while Melon is sleeping, I'm gonna take this invisibility potion that I stole from Quandale and use it against him! Boom! No one will know what I'm up to. I've just gotta sneak out of the house, back over to Quandale's laboratory, and go inside of his top secret experiment room. And whatever I find in here, I'm gonna use to prank <laughs> Melon, because he has so many diamonds, but he's not sharing. Now, I've just gotta figure out Quandale's password. <laughs> 
<laughs> he has no clue that I'm here, guys. This is perfect. Now, let's just see. Uh, Quandale's password's probably like uh, 0000. Nope, that wasn't it. 69. 69. Okay. One, two, three, four. It worked! No way! Quandale, you call me stupid, but my passwords are way more secure than yours. Geronimo! I wonder what's down here. Let's see. What types of experiments is Quandale up to? This looks insane. What the heck? He's got end crystals in his research and development area. I'm not gonna mess with that. He's got lots of redstone. Hey, I could actually use this to help wire up those lamps that I borrowed. Hmm. Yeah, no idea what these things are. What's this? Oh, Quandale's secret journal. Yeah, I'll save that for later. Oh, this looks like fun. He's concocted some wither skeleton spawn eggs, a time clock TNT, and a portal gun. What the heck is a portal gun? Oh, this is gonna be awesome. And then what's here? Oh, it looks like I found Quandale's bank vault. Yeah, don't mind if I do. I just help myself uh, to a couple diamonds. Hey, I won't be too greedy. I think that's enough. And it looks like I've got plenty of supplies for my own research and development now. And I think what I'll be developing are the best pranks ever. Time to try out this portal gun. <sighs> good morning, Sonny. <sighs> yeah, good morning, Melon. I had an interesting night. Hope you slept well. Yeah, I did. Uh, but I really don't care what you're going to say right now because I got to go to the bathroom. <sighs> <laughs> Sounds like Melon's got an emergency. Let me in! Oh, guys. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, I can hear that from outside in the TV room. You're disgusting, Melon. What's that, Sonny? I can't hear you. Guys, Melon is disgusting. He is taking an atomic dump right now. That is the stinkiest, loudest farting I have ever heard. That's it. Time for the first prank. I'm gonna take my portal gun, place one there like that, and let's find ourselves a little pit of lava, shall we? This looks perfect. Then I'll take my portal gun out and drop him off right about here. And now I wait. Oh, oh, oh. That was beautiful. Guys, I'll be honest, I never wash my hands. Or wipe. <laughs> and I'll keep that poop stewing for Sunny. Anyways, time to chill. What the heck? What? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, guys, that worked out perfectly. Let me just remove the portals before Melon notices. What just killed me? Sonny, what is going- I swear I saw a portal here a second ago. Where did it go? I'm so confused. Sonny! What's going on, Melon? Everything okay? What did you do to me? What did you do? I don't know what you ate yesterday, bro, but you were stanking up the house so bad I had to leave. Bro, what do you mean? So you're telling me you had nothing to do with me just magically falling into lava there? Wait, you magically fell into lava? That's hilarious. It's not funny, Sonny! I don't know. It sounds pretty funny to me. Dude, I'm just gonna go and work on my melon farm. Just leave me alone. Okay, guys. While Melon's tending to his melon farm, I gotta set up a little portal way in the sky! One up there. That looks good. And then I just gotta sneak up on melon and place the next one. Doop do 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 Just gotta put the melon seeds down and watch them grow. This is a awesome day besides that lava. That kind of sucks. Just gotta put the portal there and Boom! Ah! Wait, what just happened? What just happened? <laughs> I jump scared him into the portal, and now I gotta clear them. Dude, I swear there was portals this time. Something is going on. Sonny, I know you're up to something right now. What are you doing? How did you just teleport? One second you were at the melon farm, I scared you, and the next second you're back in the house. Sonny, I died. I fell from those two blocks right there, and I saw a portal. I swear I saw it this time. Yo, you're right. There are blocks in the sky. That's pretty weird. Huh? Yeah. Uh-huh, Sonny. Really weird. All right, well, I gotta go use the bathroom, but unfortunately you ruined it, so instead I'm gonna go into this room and poop in the sink. Wait, what? No, don't poop in the sink. That's disgusting. Well, maybe you should learn how to flush next time. Dude, don't do it. You're disgusting. Okay, guys, it's been a few days since I've pranked Melon, and now I'm gonna make something ridiculous. Check this out. I just gotta build a little bit like this, and it's gonna be the never-ending trap. He's gonna be falling 
calling for infinity. I gotta build up, build up the side so he can't escape it. I think this should be high enough. Then I'm gonna put glass here so I can see him falling. This is gonna be perfect. Now that the container's ready, all I gotta do is set up the portal. So I'm gonna go here, put the first one in, but not the second one yet. Because first I gotta move Melon inside of this. So let's go pay him a visit. Melon! Where are you, bro? I'm gathering wood because someone doesn't do the chores around here. Yeah, because chores are boring, dude. Nobody wants to do that. Dude, sometimes you gotta do things you don't wanna do. You're right. <laughs> You're right. And Melon, have fun punching that tree. Freezing time now! He can't move a muscle, which means I can put a portal under him and just gotta push him in like this. And there he goes. You know what? I'll even jump in with him. Shortcut. Then I just gotta come here, place a new portal like this. And now I just close him in. Unfreeze. Wait, Sonny, where am I? What's going on? <laughs> it worked! Look at him! Look at him! <laughs> Melon, do you like your new home? No, Sonny, this is awful. I really don't like this. You're gonna live there forever. So it was you. It was you with the portal gun. Uh, yeah. Do you want me to put an end to this? Please, Sonny, stop. Sonny, please. No, what's happening? No, please. Yeah, I removed the portals and you got suffocated <laughs> underground. Why are you doing this? I'll explain it to you when I'm ready. Guys, I wanna make sure my melons are all good. What is that? Why are there muted zombies by my melons? That's it. I'll take them out with my hoe. I got this. Get over here. Ow. Ow. Melon, do you need help? Sonny, please help me. There's a muted zombie and he's close to my melons. No worries. I'll freeze time and kill him. But you can freeze time? Yeah, I'll freeze time and kill him. All right. Just got to pick this boy up and drag him over to big man melon. I think right about here should be good. And unfreeze. Wait, how can you freeze? What the heck? <laughs> that was beautiful. That was the best thing I've ever seen. Sonny, did you sneak into Quandale Dingle's secret laboratory? Yes, I did, Melon. Turns out you do have a brain in there. <laughs> Get wrecked. Dang it. Sonny dropped his items. I gotta grab them right now. This is my chance to stop him. Come on. Come on. Yes. They're right here. Yes. I have the portal gun and the time watch. It's time to get my revenge. What the heck? That muted zombie killed me so hard I lost my portal gun and my time clock. Uh, this isn't good. Whatever. I'm gonna watch TV. Okay, guys. It's time for the first prank. Look at Sonny in there watching TV, this scumbag. Now, I'm gonna dump a whole lot of animals on his head. Just let me in, sheep. Okay. Put a portal right there. Yep. I'm gonna need you to stand on those portals, sheep. Thank you very much. Then, <laughs> time to put the second portal right Right above Sunny. And... Kabooya! Uh, why are there sheeps in the house? Guys, Sunny's so confused. Hold on, I'm gonna drop a bunch of cows on him now. Whatever, I'm just gonna watch my show. And cows! Get in there, cows. I need you to get in there. Bro, why are there cows falling into my room? Dude, I'm trying to watch my show! I am utterly confused! Uh, uh, wait, there's a portal on the ceiling! Melon? Melon, I see you! Die! Uh, Sunny, uh... Um, I don't appreciate that. Ow! Yeah, that's right. That's right. Go away. Turn this portal off and get these cows out of here. Okay, fine. I'll clean them up. Relax. Calm down, Sonny, all right? That's it, Melon. I'm getting rid of your cows the old-fashioned way. What are you doing? What are you doing? I gotta get out of here. You brought this on to yourself. Let me out of here. Let me out of here. Now watch, Melon, as your cows... <laughs> What have you done? That's it, Sonny. You've messed with the wrong melon. Freeze time! Yes? Check out what I found. <laughs> I found myself a stronghold. Now, set up the first portal here, and all I gotta do is set the next portal on Sonny. Would you look at that, Sonny? Time to send you to the end. Thank you. Yes! And now it's time to unfreeze time itself. Let's go! Ah! <laughs> hey, Sonny. I may have sent you all the way to the end. <laughs>
Melon, I'm trapped. Why would you do this? Because, Sonny, you trolled me too hard. And with great power comes great responsibility. So I'm locking you away and returning these items to Quandale. Melon, you have no idea what you've done. The Ender Dragon is here, and so are Mute and Enderman. There's so many of them. I'm gonna die. I don't know. That sounds like a you problem. Ow! The dragon, why? Wait, I respawned at the end. Melon, please. Melon, I don't know what you did, but you messed up the time continuum. Please! I guess you'll have to defeat the Ender Dragon somehow. Bruh! Yo, Quandale! What are you sitting on, bro? Quandale is levitating. He's giving a rose to Quandale. This is so romantic. I'll come back later. Yo, Quandale, is this a better time? Yeah, okay, okay. Well, listen. Sunny stole the portal gun and the time clock. So, I'm just returning it to you. With great power comes great responsibility. And neither of us are responsible. Wait, what do you mean you're missing 10,000 diamonds? Uh, I'm out of here! Guys, quickly, press like and subscribe before he sends his iron golems after me. That's it, guys. I'm gonna be the richest player to ever beat the Ender Dragon. Diamond blocks. Yeah, Melon thinks he's returning all the items to Quandale. He's got no clue that I got all this money on me. The shmoney. Although the dragon has a clue. It just tried to kill me for it. But I survived. Half a heart. Eh, no, I didn't survive. This is a Minecraft build battle. But I secretly <laughs> trolled Melon by morphing into different mobs. Sonny, you make me so mad. If you guys want me to get revenge, comment Melon emoji and subscribe. It's time for a build battle, Melon. I've been looking forward to the next one of these. So I can pummel. No, no, no. Oh, we both died. Ah, oh, you're so annoying, Sonny. Stop punching me off. That's my job. You punch me, bro. Let's go. Melon the Great this way. Okay, wait, why is there another sign behind here? Great at not being goaded? Bro, that's right. Get off of this. Oh, wait, no, no. Truce, truce. Truce, truce, truce. And then Sonny, the build battle goat this way. Let's go. Okay, Melon. Round one starts now. Okay, I'm going. Wait, I found a sign that says Melon that not goat is ugly. <laughs> yeah, boy. That's not cool, Sonny. We both know that you planted that sign there. Nope, it's not a plant. Oh, also, Melon, I'm jumping through to your side really quick before you start. Melon, this build battle's a little different. We've got five rounds to play, so you better speed build. I'm out of here. Okay, Hey, chill. Hey, uh, round one, you gotta build yourself a big statue of your beautiful, hideous, juicy melon. I've already got it. Get the heck out of here. Okay, I'm covering you up. Okay, guys, this round, we're building statues of ourselves. So I need to grab some yellow and I'm gonna get some concrete. What else do I look like here? I need some black. So let's get some black concrete. All right, guys. First, I'm gonna start with my legs and torso. I think that's just gonna be be like a big old rectangle. Build it out. Shallower than this. Yeah, that looks good. I need pink, white, orange, purple. Oh boy, I need some colors. Concrete, orange, purple, pink. I got some blue in there, some green in there, some white in there. Is that everything? I think we're good. Oh, I need red. Red, concrete. That doesn't look very vibrant though. That's okay. We'll just start with that for now. And it's time to build. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna start with my legs. So I'm gonna do like one, two, three. One, two, three. Is that a good size? Build out this way. I think this is a more realistic size for me to build. Now it's just time to fill out the frame. Let's go. That's not too bad. I might have to make it bigger later. We'll adjust as we go. Now I'm gonna put a little gap in the middle and go like this. Get my legs started. And then we gotta build these boys up because I look thick and juicy. Let me tell you, I've been working out, guys. These cats. Calves are ridiculous. Look at my thighs, bro. They're huge. I'm getting distracted by my quad fathers there. Let me just build this a little higher. And I gotta replicate it over here because I do have two legs. And then it's time for the pants. How do my pants look? Okay, they're like the same length as my legs. So we need to go up like this. I might be making this too big. That's okay. I could be super duper tall. I'm gonna do these across like this now to connect the pants. Oh, this is looking good, guys. I might 
might be the most goaded builder. And then we do one more layer. Yeah, we got legs. Comment down below whose build you think's gonna be better. And now I need to work on my torso and my arms. My arms gotta come down a little bit like this though. Like so. Oh yeah, this is gonna look beautiful actually. Like no cap. Ooh, this is looking good. And then what did I do? I gotta go over and then we go down. Yeah, there we go. Sunny is looking clean. Now I just gotta build this up a bunch. Now check this out. I've got the torso and legs built. Now it's time to build the arms. Time to build these arms right out. Go. Arm number one complete. Time to build my second arm. Okay, guys. I made a few modifications to the build. We got some nice three-dimensional pants now. And I started to work on my head as well. Oh, this is gonna look so good. I just gotta build this boy up nice and square. How many do I have here again? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Lucky number thirteen, bruh. Why did I do it like that? That's a bit spooky. Then I just gotta fill it in. Yes, my noggin is ready. Now I just gotta add my smile and I've gotta put my glasses on. Get those sunnies. Okay, so my mouth should be like this and we gotta have that nice smile and then I got some gray teeth back here like this and my tongue. I'm gonna put my tongue big like that and should I have bottom teeth? No, that looks a bit weird. It needs, it does need some shading. How's that? That's pretty goaded. Actually, wait, it needs to be like this and like this and boom, I've got my smile now. Let's go. And arm two is completed. Now it's time for the hard part. I gotta build out the head. Some green concrete. Here we go. Time to build it out. Something like this. It up a bit. And I gotta do this a few more times and then the framing will be done. Now for the sunglasses. This is gonna be a bit tricky. Just taking a quick look. Yeah, it's gotta come down like this. Go all the way across. Wrap it around town. Something like that. Yeah, that's pretty decent. I can fix it up more after. And then it's gotta have these. And now I gotta add my colors and the frames. Okay, we need purple and pink like this. Then I need red, orange, and green. We got red. We got green. And I just need a touch of orange. That's not too bad, but this looks a bit funky, guys. I made my glasses a bit too sharp. I gotta do some adjustments. Yeah, that looks way better. They're a bit chunkier now. Check me out. My build is finished. Now, here's the best part. I'm gonna go troll melon now. I just gotta go down to the bottom, grab a little TNT, a flint and steel, maybe a few creeper spawn eggs, because check this out. Morph big man Sunny into a creeper. He'll never suspect a thing. Now all I've gotta do is wander over to his base and detonate a few TNT. Yo, guys, check out the build so far. All I've gotta do is fill in the eyes and mouth. And hold on, let me just add a little something right here. I'm gonna make myself pee. Oh, I'm so stupid. Yo, guys, what is Melon up to? Look at his build. Why is it peeing? That is disgusting. I gotta sneak to the back of his build quickly before he finishes up his face. Guys, he totally deserves this because he made his character peeing. That's so weird. Just gotta build up the back of him. Oh, he's so done. Now I just gotta fill out the eyes and then my build is just about complete. In three, two... Guys, I'm breaking into the back of his head right now. I just need to break one more block. What is that? Why is there a creeper? Yo, 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 yo. This is not cool. What is going on? Wait, Melon, you have a creeper at your base? Hold on. I gotta go protect my base to make sure it's safe. What is going on? No, he's detonating TNT. No! Uh, why is there a ghost of Big Man Sunny floating away? Wait, it says Steve McSteve. I hate Steve McSteve. He's such an evil creeper. Bro, what the heck? Yo, Melon, time's up, bro. Let's check out our builds. Dude, a creeper blowed my build up. And I'm pretty sure that creeper was you, Sonny. Or Steve McSteve. I don't know who Steve McSteve is. It was for sure Steve, bro. I mean... Oh, yeah. It was for sure Steve, huh? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm in my build right now, Melon. I'm in my... I'm inside of my head doing some repairs. Oh, 
wow. Your build looks so cool, Sonny. Wow. Yeah, Melon, I'm up here. Hey. Yeah, I'm sure that creeper wasn't you, Sonny. Wow, that's insane that a creeper blew up my build that could put these TNT down and fly around. Bro, the creeper was clearly Steven McSteve. Whatever, bro. Look at your stupid build. Isn't it nice, bro? I think I did a pretty good job. Look at me. Yeah, it's a good build, but mine was also good until you blew it up. It wasn't me, bro. It was Steven. Okay, whatever you say, Sonny. I'll remember that in the next round. Dude, you kind of look like an evil Halloween jack-o'-lantern. You know where the mouth gets really creepy? That's what you look like. Bro, you're actually not wrong. So does my build win then? No, you lost because you made it pee, which is really weird. Dang it! Melon, do you know the rules for round two? Yes, we're building farms, Sonny. And check this out. I'm gonna water bucket clutch. You got this. Yo, I'm actually the goat. You actually nailed it. Yeah, I'm gonna do the same thing, except I'm in creative mode. Water bucket clutch! Easy. Yeah, wow. You're so great. Okay, you have three minutes to work on a farm build. That's all I need. Okay, guys, since Sonny wanted to cheat and blow up my build in the last round, I'm gonna use a little bit of world edit here. Okay, guys, for my farm, I'm gonna go with that village look. So I'm gonna take oak. I'm gonna need a water bucket. You're gonna need a trusty diamond hoe to till the lands. I'm gonna take some sheets, and I'm gonna also take myself a little bit of dirt. I think that's all I need for this. And then it's like this. You go like boom, bang, bing. So, let's go. How big do I want my farm to be? I think I'm gonna go right here. That looks good. And I'm gonna fly all the way over here, let's say. Bada bing. Slash, slash, set Minecraft fence. Let me do this. Wait, no. I want, I want walls. Gonna make a goaded little farm. Nothing too crazy. Then I put the dirt. Then we got water and dirt. And we close it in. My farm is gonna be done in a world record speed run. Oak fence. Wait, this is not how it was supposed to go. Undo. Undo. Water. Oh, she looking good. And I could put melons here, but nobody wants more melons in this game. There's enough melon to go around. So I'm just putting some sweet. And yeah, my build done. Wait, no, no. I can make this cooler. I can make this cooler. Check this out. It didn't say it had to be crops, right? So now I'm gonna make an electrified animal pen. None of my beef will escape. Here we go. Two types of farms in one speed run. Now that's goat mode. It's supposed to be a block up. Then we can do... Dang it! Why is this not working? Beautiful. Oh, we need a little carpet on the side like this. Boom. Now I can get in on all of the corners. Here we go. That's what I wanted. Now we it's time to build out the most beautiful Malone farm of all time. And then I take some beef. And I say, don't you touch that fence, cow, or you will die. Yeah, that's right. Oh, wait. I want some of these guys, too. They're pretty cool. Get some mushroom cows. Yeah, there we go. That's a nice farm right there. Okay, that's enough farming for one day. Time to troll melon. And I become a snow golem. Let's go. And now check this out. Yo, one of my cows just vaporized. I heard that. That. Yo, chill, Mushroom. Don't touch the edge. It's dangerous. No, no. Another cow got vaporized. I guess this iron electrified fence wasn't such a great idea, but it is keeping them inside of the pens at all costs. Anyways, as I was saying, I gotta go troll Melon as a snow golem. I got snow as well, so I'm gonna stomp on his crops and place snow all over them. I just can't let him hit me because he'll do a lot of damage. Wait a second. What am I doing, guys? With one simple command, I can make my life so much easier. Go. Yo, guys, I don't know what Melon's building here. He's got a gigantic square farm with nothing in it so far. He's doing something weird with world edits. Let's do 30% water and 70% melon. Let's go. Now it's time to just spawn a ton of animals. Give me the cows. Give me the sheep. Give me the chicken. What the heck did he just do? He turned this into a juicy melon oasis. I don't want him to see me though. Not yet. Oh, my farm is so beautiful. Yes. Wait a second, guys. I have an idea. He's put a lot of farm animals into this and there's water everywhere. I'm going to replace the water with lava. Two can play the world at a game. His animals, they're all burning. Yo, what just happened to my build? Why is it? 
in lava. No. And now I enter as a snow golem. Why is there a snow golem in my base? Cover it all. Destroy his melons. What is going on? No. I hope if he kills me, it says Steve McSteve. It better not say Sonny. Burn them all. Baby sheep. No baby sheeps. In the lava you go. Yo, guys, I have an idea. The ultimate play. Replace near 100 melons with pumpkins. Get out of here. Wait, it is you. It literally has a big man, Sonny Ghost. You've been trolling me this whole time, Sonny. My melons are pumpkins. What have you done? <laughs> <laughs> and melon, the time's up, bro. Let's freaking go. I don't know what you're talking about. Place near 100 pumpkin melon. Let's go. All the pumpkins have become melons. This is a lava melon farm, you fool. I'm pretty sure we just crashed the game, Melon. The animals are not moving. None of the commands are registering. I guess that means your farm is broken. I think that means my farm wins. Yep, there it is. Bruh, you won the war of commands. We might have crashed the server, but you actually got your melons back. You know what else I won the war of? Smacking you! Dang it! Now, let's see whose farm is better. Your ugly melon farm. What do you mean, bro? This is the most unique original farm ever. A lava melon farm. Have you ever seen lava growing melons? Bet you you haven't. Then fine, I get the credit for this farm. I turned it to lava. Nope, that's your fault. You just added inspiration to my build. Whatever, bro. Come and check out my farm. It's a classic. Hold on. Don't look yet. Bro, there's a whole lot of slime balls around here. I don't see a whole lot of animals though. Bruh, chill. The slimes came and ate my crops and destroyed my cows. But you want to see something really funny about my build? Look at this. It's an electrified fence so when the cows touch the edge bro you have an electric fence that's crazy <laughs> i keep my animals secured but what's up with your crops like they're not really well mended bro you're a troll you're gonna live to regret the day that you did that let me tell you bro you started this and where are your cows at your electric fence killed all your cows no it's you smacking them but yeah the electric fence actually kind of did destroy them all right sonny i vote my farm is better i'll give you props just this one you crashed the server. That's how powerful your farm was. Let's go. So let's go to the third build. Melon, the third round's theme is fish aquarium. I'm gonna make the most goaded aquarium you've ever seen. Oh no. No. Bruh, use creative mode, you nerd. I'll see you in five minutes. I'll see ya, Sonny. Okay, guys. For my aquarium, I'm gonna need some reinforced glass. I'm also going to need some coral. Okay, guys. Sonny continues to cheat, so I'm gonna cheat myself. And I'll get to that in a little bit. But to start, let's just build the aquarium frame. First, gotta give myself some glass. Give myself some world editing powers. <laughs> oh... We go like this, and then we go over here like this, and we build way up. It's gonna be a thick aquarium. And then, yeah, I'm gonna use World Edit again. Hopefully, I won't crash the server. Outline that in some reinforced glass, because my aquarium will never falter. And then, I need some water in here. I'm gonna make myself a hollow sphere. Let's make it out of glass, and let's give it a radius of 30. Set this to water. Ah. Yes, this is nice. Yo, check this out. This is gonna be a sick aquarium. Now, just got to fill this up with water somehow. And now check out my plan. I'm gonna morph Big Man Sunny into a fish. Let's go. And it's time to decorate. We're gonna need some sand at the bottom. This is gonna be the greatest home for fish of all time. Ever. Like, seriously, of all time forever and eternity. What? What if I stand directly in the middle, be right here, do a sphere this time, water, and give it a radius of 15. Bro, this thing literally goes into the void. Yo, I'm even gonna add a really cool aquarium fish hideout. Check this out. It'll be like this and like this. It's like a secret rock cave. Oh, this is cool. This is gonna be so cool. Yes. Ooh, I need slabs. Perfect. This is epic, bro. 
bro. One more time. Oh boy. I made it a little bit big, I think. Wait, no. This is actually perfect, bro. It doesn't go outside the walls at all. Then inside of it, we have some coral. And we need some yellow sunny corals. Yeah, there we go. And then look at this. Look at this right here. That's the special sunny block. Beautiful. And on top of it... Oh, coral on the walls? Let's go. Now it's time to fill up my aquarium with a bunch of beautiful fishes. Let's give myself tropical fish. And then this one has the big coral on top. That looks goaded. And then over here, we have some more corals. Puffer fish. Salmons. Mix it up a little bit. Oh, this place is gonna look so cool. And then this is gonna be our little food spot. I'm gonna put it right here. And then I'm gonna fill it up with none other than melons. We live on melons in this aquarium. Look at that delicious compost. Yummy. Spawn these bad boys in. Yes. Spawn in all the fish. Hopefully they don't fall into the void. That would be tragic. Give myself these tropical fish. And then I'm gonna add the aquarium cleaning device. You've got to make sure you keep it spick and span out here. Now, let's spawn in a guardian and an elder guardian. Hopefully they don't kill the rest of these fishes. Dang it, I can't spawn it in because it's in peaceful. Hold on. Difficulty easy. Now I can spawn in some guardians. Oh, and rods. Beautiful. That is our cleaning device. That'll keep the tank's water fresh at all times. And check out my aquarium. It's perfect. It's so beautiful. I'm pretty happy with my aquarium. I actually quite like it. Wait, what am I doing? We need fish. Here we go. A couple of puffers, bunch of tropicals. Oh, this is looking awesome. It's not a fish tank without slammers. And then one squid. Now it's time to troll <laughs> Melon's build. Let me just grab this. He's going to be making his own fish tank, but he's got some surprises on the way. I'm going to add guardians and elder guardians to his aquarium. Yo, what did he do? Okay, I got to give Melon some props. This thing looks insane. And he's already put guardians in there? What is this? I'm so afraid. He even has the fabled mysterious creature called the fish piggy. Oh boy. I don't even think I control him. He's gone above and beyond this build. I got to give him credit where credit's due. That's insane. But I think I could probably still troll him. Let's give him some mining fatigue. Boom. And I'm out of here. What is going on? Yo, Melon, enjoy some mining fatigue. Bro, what the heck? Why these things just spawn on me? Now I watch him suffer from far. I'm going to change his game mode to survival. Enjoy that mining fatigue. Why am I in survival? Yo, this is so weird. Wait, I actually avoided all of them. I'm okay. No, mining fatigue. Are you kidding me? Oh, poor Melon. Hey, Sonny, get away from me, bro. What is wrong with you? Oh, you don't like mining fatigue for your build? You're not supposed to see it. Time's not up. Uh, time ended, bro. Oh, well, what do you think of my build then? It's honestly very impressive. This is not the type of aquarium shape I would have gone with, but it's very round and defies all logic of Minecraft. What do you mean, bro? You made a sphere, bro. They ain't supposed to be circles in Minecraft. True. I literally defied physics for my build. Let's see yours, Sonny. And it's got a little melon crown. You see that? Yeah, that's really cool, dude. I just want to do something really nice to your build. Do you mind? Don't turn the water into lava, Sonny. Okay, I won't. I promise. I'll turn the glass into lava. Whoa, that was weird, bro. Just all turned into obsidian instantly. My fish are safe. Yeah, they're secured. The most secure aquarium ever. <laughs> this looks like a meteor right now. What the heck? It actually looks really cool. I'm not gonna lie. Well, I'm glad you like your new lava aquarium. Thank you. Let's see your build now, Sonny. Let's do it. It's right here. It's not as big as yours, but I think it's cooler. Wow, this is so lame, Sonny. What are you talking about? Go inside. Wait, where'd my mobs go? What? There's literally no fish in here, Sonny. What the heck? You didn't have fish either, so don't even lie. You only had guardians. Yeah, I did. I had elder guardians, tropical fish. What is this? Hold on. I'm adding my fish back. That was not cool. The slamming army! One 
some squid, pufferfish, and tropicals. That was what it was supposed to look like. I forgot to add squeeds. Honestly, your aquarium is really cool. There's a lot of attention to detail, but Sonny, you forgot one thing. No, I didn't. I even put melons. Look in the composter, bro. This is what my fish live off of. They eat melons. That's so messed up. Sonny, what the heck? Oh, they're so beautiful. See, I even have a tank cleaner. Your fish tank's gonna get really dirty really fast. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I think your build might be cooler than mine. Let's let the viewers decide. Comment down below whose aquarium you think was more goaded, Sonny's or Melon's? All right, Sonny. This is the fourth and final round. Are you ready? I was born ready. Because all the viewers are commenting that Sonny's side is goaded. Although, when I look back at yours, there's a lot more stuff happening. Yeah, because someone sabotaged it every round. It looks pretty cool, though, bro. All right, I'm gonna go work on my build. It's time to make the best house possible. You've got five minutes. I got this. Let's go. Clutch. Okay, guys, for my house, I'm just gonna blatantly outright cheat. Check this out. I'm going to the TNTs, and I have a lot of choices here. Look, look, I can make a little brick house. We'll start with that. I'm gonna have a ton of homes by the end of this. I'm gonna put my brick house right here. Let's blow this TNT up. All right, dudes, it's time to build the most epic of houses that have ever been made. Boom! Check this out. I've got a cute little house. If I go inside of it, I'd even come with some chests and furnaces. It's so beautiful. Time. Build this up with some wood. Yeah, no, wood's organic. We're gonna build an all-organic house today. Planks. Yep, we're gonna need some of these. Yeah, this is what I like to see. But that's not enough. I need more. I need a bigger house. Which is why I'm gonna use the mansion TNT. I don't know how much space I need for this, so I'm gonna go all the way back here. This should be big enough. And activate it. Yeah. Yo, look at the special effects. This thing is crazy. Hey, yo, it ate me. Oh, look at this. I've got a mansion. This is pretty nice. It's actually a really good build. But that's not the end of my build. There's another one called the city firework. This thing is goaded. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Go over here. Place it down. Spark it up. It's going crazy. Build it. Yes. Even my mansion's been upgraded. I got this crazy crazy witch house inside of my house. You know, like, which house is which? Yo, even Sonny got an upgrade. His whole right arm is a house now. I'm built different. Doors. That looks pretty cool. I'm liking this house so far. I'm putting my heart and soul into this one. Okay, I think my builds are good now. It's just time I go and mess with Melon. And to do that, I'm gonna need a couple of dynamites. We'll We'll go with the freeze dynamite. Lightning is a classic. Reaction dynamite. I don't even know what that does. Rainbow dynamite, so much fun. What else is in here? The picky dynamite. Well, let's see what that thing is. Gravity dynamite sounds like fun. And if that's not enough, I will add the most powerful dynamite of them all. Fireworks. Just kidding. Nuclear waste. He's so doomed. Now I just morph myself into a ghast. This this marshmallow's going on an adventure. Hey, Melon, that's a mighty fine house you've got there. Sonny, the time isn't up. You're not supposed to be looking at my house right now. I'm not looking at your house right now. It's fine, bro. Bro, you're being super sus. And then, guys, then I lob a rainbow dynamite over the top. Yo, no, you're ruining my house. Sonny, what are you doing? What are you talking about? I'm back on my side of the map building right now. <sighs> You want to play these games, Sonny? Guys, I'm putting Melon in survival mode, and I'm going to throw this at him. Why am I in survival mode? Yo! My house will protect me. One wooden log is all I need. No! Yes! And then I throw the freeze dynamite. Turn it all to ice. Yo, his build is cold. You're a gas, Sonny? What are you talking about, bro? This is a marshmallow. It's naturally spawning in the overworld. You want to play these games, Sonny, huh? 
Melon, look at your house, bro. It's ice cold. Bro, you literally destroyed my house. I worked so hard on that. And what the heck is this? How do you have a whole village? Why do you have so many houses? I spent a lot of time and energy to build these homes block by block using a giant TNT destruction. Bro, you're such a cheeser. You know what? Fine. Since you worked so hard on this. Yo! Melon, what did you do? Yo, looks like I won the build battle. I don't see any of your builds left. Yo, my aquarium, it's alive. How did your aquarium survive that? Built out of reinforced glass. That is so stupid, bro. Yo, Melon, your aquarium is still alive. It's okay, it's made out of obsidian. No mere firework could ever destroy it. You sure about that? Yeah, coated in lava. I wouldn't be so sure. I'm covering it in nuclear waste. No, Sonny, stop. You're gonna kill my fish. Disintegrated. My fish aren't even in there anymore. I melted them with nuclear power already. Wait, there's one fish left. Yes, one tropical fish, and he's blue. Such a cool and rare color. Yeah? How cool? No, Sonny, chill. What are those? Uh, Sonny, they're not even blowing up. The fish is still alive. The fish is all powerful. Not for long. How's that for all powerful? No! It's dropped into the void! No! What is wrong with you, Sonny? Don't worry, I'm sure he'll be fine. Oh, you destroyed the only thing I cared about. Gregory. No! Gregory could eat my dynamite! Yo, chill! But you know what you guys shouldn't chill out on? Pressing that like and subscribe button! Quick, before these gas kill Melon! No! No! Today in Minecraft, I prank my friend Melon using the Morph Mod. Aw, hey, it's a cute little baby creeper. Wait, why is it flashing? Ah! Subscribe if you want to see more epic pranks. Yo, Melon, it's a beautiful day in Minecraft, don't you think? Yeah, bro, my melons are juicy, my chickens are plump and ripe, dude. They're laying their eggs. Look at this, man. This is perfect. Why would you call chickens ripe, bro? That's weird. Oh, oh no! I spotted chicken outside. <laughs> Don't worry, Melon. I'll bring it some cookies because I have cookies for everybody today, including you. Here's one for the melon and here's one for the chickens. And then guys, I got one more for you. Just make sure you're subscribed to our channel. Cookie. Melon, I'm going to go do some fishing. I'll be back in a bit. Bro. <laughs> All right. See you, dude. Look at these chickens. Look at them. Just look at them. Okay, guys. I'm just going to swim away from our house a little tiny bit and then I'm gonna prank melon so good check this out i am morphing into a fox and now i'm gonna run over to melon's precious chickens and destroy them but it'll be totally not suspicious because that's what foxes actually like to do in real life and in minecraft do 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 i gotta be careful guys melon's right there jump in the window Yo, wait, what the heck? Bro, what is it? What? What did I just see? I gotta stay hidden, guys. I gotta dodge this melon. Take the netherite sword. Let's go. Wait, what the heck? Why is there a fox here? No! Get out of my chicken pen! What are you doing? Get out of here! Melon, that's normal, bro. Foxes are meant to hunt down chickens, dude. Leave the poor guy alone. What are you talking about, bro? Sonny, do you even know what just happened? Ow! Ow, it hits hard. Just leave him alone, bro. I'm sure he'll go away. Okay, he's leaving my chickens alone now. I'm okay with that. Okay, guys, I destroyed most of Melon's chickens, and he hasn't caught on that this fox isn't real. <laughs> Let's go. I gotta do more damage. I gotta destroy his fence posts. How did that fox open this fence gate, bro? He let all the chickens out, massacred them. That was so weird. But I guess foxes do hunt chickens in Minecraft, so that kind of makes sense. Maybe it's like some weird mod or something. Okay, guys, I'm sunny again, and it's time for me to go back in the house and put this netherite sword away before Melon notices. And maybe this raw chicken I probably don't want to hold. <laughs> Let's just put this back where it belongs. And uh, Melon never checks the coal chest, so that's fine. Yo, Sonny, we need to make some trades with the villagers. Do you got any emeralds? I do, bruh. Check the enchanting chest. 35. I'll give you half of them. Let's go. Did you get these on your fishing trip? No, bro. I didn't go looting any water monuments. I wouldn't do that without you, bro. I need your backup for that. Okay, okay. Well, let's 
go and trade, Sunny. Let's get some big villager trades. I can't wait. I totally love trading with villagers. They're not my mortal enemies. Wait, why don't why don't you like villagers? I, I didn't say that. Villagers are totally cool. I really like them. That's what I was saying. Yo, Sunny, you would not believe the investments I just made. Look how many melons I have. I got a whole stack. No, don't. I don't trust you with those. I don't trust you at all. <laughs> I get one. You can have one melon. You better take good care of it. All right. Okay. No. What is wrong with you? <laughs> it's okay. It's gonna grow more melons in the future. You're evil, Sonny. Pure evil. Melon, it's nighttime, bro. Forget about being evil or good. Let's just sleep this off so it can be daytime again. Yeah, you're right. Time to go to bed. My favorite time. I love sleeping. Yo, who put this villager in our house? I don't know. Dude, that's that's my boy Quandale Gort. Don't, don't touch Gort. Too bad. I only like Quandale Dingleberry and Gort. I don't like the combination of the two. Okay, whatever, bro. Let's just head to sleep, dude. Good idea. Okay, guys, I'm not actually gonna sleep. Check this out. I'm gonna get out of bed while it's still nighttime, and I'm gonna morph into a zombified villager. Yes, check me out. This is beautiful. And now I am the real Gort. I need to go back down here, grab my netherite sword, and slaughter. Oh, I'm too big. Uh, that was awkward. Let me just break this. There we go. And where was I? And slaughter Gort Quandale. Along with the rest of Melon's chickens. None shall survive. And then even worse than that, I'm gonna go in the village and kill all of them. That way Melon can never trade again. No more villager trades. They're all doomed. And now that I've eliminated my villager friends, it's time to replace them with zombie villagers. Let's go. And check this out. This is gonna be so funny. I'm even gonna put some outside and inside of our home. And now I just gotta really quickly get upstairs to bed and go demorph, return to Sunny, and Melon! Melon! Get out of bed! What's going on? It's an emergency! Bro, kill these! Kill these zombies, dude! Yo, I don't have a sword. I have nothing to fight them with, Sunny. You have a sword right here! No, chill, chill, chill out, chill out, chill out, Sunny. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. That's not cool, that's not cool. Here, you take the sword. All right, I'll be the hero that this world needs, not the one it deserves. Die! Guys, while Melon's killing those villager zombies, I'm gonna grab more and put them in the house. There's so many of these things. Melon, help me! Why are there so many? Anything but the baby ones. Oh, no. Why are you after me? I'm not the one with the sword. Die! There's so many zombies, bro. What the heck? Wait, I've almost slaughtered them all. I'm in creative. That way, they don't attack me anymore. And now, I'm gonna spawn in Melon's mortal enemy, the witch. What the heck? Four witches just spawned. I gotta leave. I gotta leave. They're gonna kill me. Bro, I gotta find some villagers to help me out. Melon, what's going on? Bro, there's four witches. I can't deal with them. Oh, stay away, zombies. Stay away. Melon, you need to get to the iron golem fast. Bro, where's the iron golem? There he is. Wait, he's so low. Kill those baby zombies. Yeah. Wait, why is there a witch on me? Hey, what is this? You got this iron golem. Oh my God, he's destroying them. Let's go. He's an absolute chat. Yo, the witches, they poisoned me. Use the creeper against them. Yes. Oh no, I'm poisoned. Sonny, where are all the villagers? All the villagers are dead, bro. Wait, I found one. It's been an apocalypse. We should have never gone to sleep and left them unprotected. Oh my dude. Dude, I knew we should have stayed up. There's one alive, Melon. Wait, what the heck? Bro, he made it. Sunny, what are you doing? Hey, chill. Don't hurt my villager. Wait, Sunny, why did you have all this raw chicken on you? That wasn't me, bro. That was the villager. Uh, ow! Well, I guess we'll never know. Melon, it's time we get more diamonds, bro. We need a fresh set of netherite in case there's another zombie apocalypse. So let's head down to the mines. Dude, you're right. Let's go all the way down. Sunny, I built this myself. Don't you think it's beautiful? Hey, why? Why are you trying to betray me like that? I don't know. I just wanted to hit you. But check this out. It's freshly mined out for us. We just got to mine straight. Okay, yeah, we can go down too. Yeah, yeah, bro. I'm going to go to diamond level. I don't know what you're thinking. I just like digging straight. Well, leave me alone, bro. We don't need to dig in the same spot. So waste of our efforts. Okay, okay, fine. You go somewhere else then. I'm getting diamonds. Let's go. Melon, I'm going to find diamonds first, bro. I'm going deep into this ravine and I might even have to do some 
strip mining. We shall see, Sonny. First one to get a diamond wins. Let's go. Okay, guys. What Melon doesn't know is I have zero interest in finding diamonds. This next prank is going to be the best one so far. Check out my inventory. I've got a bow, some arrows, some cobblestone explosives, and best of all, an arrow dynamite. Now all I need to do is morph. Time to become an itsy bitsy teeny weeny little bat. And as a bat, I could fly, I think, right? Oh, I guess I can't fly, but I can jump really high. Now I've just got to go up to Melon and freak him out. Spooky bat coming through. Yo, bro, there's a bat in this game. It's flying kind of weird. Yo, guys, look at Melon. I'm flying right behind him. <laughs> tickling him. I'm literally tickling that boy. Bro, what the heck? Dude, there's this bat just looking at me. He's being all weird. Yo, go away. Go away, bat. Bro, bats are normal in caves. You need to chill out. Yeah, but it was like right behind me lurking. It was creepy. Yeah, I hate when that happens, bro. Why do bats sometimes do that? This bat is so weird. Go away. Shoo, shoo. Get out of here. Scram. Okay, guys, I think that's enough of this bat business. It's time to morph into a skeleton. Oh, now Melon's gonna get it. Oh, I need to take that off. <laughs> that would have been awkward. Yo, bro, there's the skeleton. You think you can mess with me? Huh? I'm gonna whack ya. Let's get that melon. Yo, skeleton. Bro, chill out, skeleton. I'm gonna have to hurt you. Yo, what the heck? I gotta get out of here. The skeleton's too crazy. Yo, what is that? Yo, chill. Stay away. Stay away. And now, guys, check this out. I'm gonna put dynamite cobblestone above melon. Bro, what's going on? Are you okay? Bro, there was this crazy skeleton. I think he's gone now, though. Just gonna dig my way out of here. Melon, chill. I'm gonna come back up and help. Okay, guys, I'm gonna demorph really fast and go help melon out as sunny. Melon, are you okay, bro? What's going on? Bro, I'm stuck down here. There's this insane skeleton. He could throw like a million arrows at once. I'm coming back up, dude. Are you good? No, I'm stuck down here, bro. What am I gonna do? Just come back up. There's no skeleton. I'm right here, bro. You're fine. Okay, okay. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> what was that? Dude, I just exploded from nothing. Wait, are you telling me there was a skeleton that had a baby with a creeper and made an exploding skeleton? I don't know, dude. I have no idea what just happened. Sure, we'll go with that. Bro, that was weird. I don't even know what to say anymore. I'm staying away from you, bro. You are cursed. I don't know what's happening, Sonny. What is happening to me? What mods did you put on this server? What mods did I not put on this server? <laughs> what the heck, dude? I just got shot again. Was that you? I don't know what's going on, bro. This is a really creepy night. It's raining. There's a thunderstorm. What is going on? I'm just going to sleep. I need to sleep it off. Me too. Yo, I swear you're shooting me with a bow. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just make it daytime again, bro. Yo, Melon, before we go exploring again, let me make us some new pickaxes. Grab these and these. Yo, am I getting an upgrade from iron? You're getting a diamond one because I just got seven diamonds when we went mining. Let's go. You might have got blown up by a skeleton. I was productive. Good for you, Sonny. I'm actually proud of you for getting diamonds. You finally did something. Hey, thanks, man. Sonny, I think we should head to the nether now. Yeah, let's do it, bro. We need to get some fresh netherite. Let's go. Melon, we should split up and cover more ground. That'll be the quickest way to get a bunch of netherite. You're right. Let's start digging, Sonny. I will collect the most ancient debris you've ever Ever seen. No, I shall collect far more than you could ever comprehend. But first, I gotta get out of this forest, man. These pigs are chasing me. Melon, I found a bastion. Wait, you found a bastion already? Yeah, bro, you gotta get over here. I'll get you the coordinates. Where are you? Where are you? Okay, guys, before I give Melon these coordinates, I gotta be quick. I'm morphing into a piglet super quick. Oh, I look good. And then I gotta take this gear off, grab one golden sword and one golden helmet. Perfect. <laughs> Melon will never know. Melon, the cords are 50. 50, 75 minus 170. All right, bro. I'm on my way. Hurry up, dude. There's not a lot of loot left. I'm taking it all. Yo, Sonny, I found the bastion. I'm inside of it, dude. Hurry up. Get in here. There's so much loot. Bro, there's so many piglins. How am I gonna... Dude, there's so many things. Holy crap. They're all chasing me. I gotta build up. Melon, you're gonna be fine, bro. Ah! Sonny, I'm not fine. I am anything but fine right now. Do you need some help? Yes, I need help. I need help, Sonny. I'm coming. I'm coming as quick as I can. Yo, Sonny, where are you, bro? I don't even see you. I'm almost out of the bastion. How is this thing hitting me? What the heck? 
Ow! How is this thing hitting me? I'm up high. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No, he's got a bow and arrow. We gotta keep moving. Keep moving. Piglins got their AIs updated recently. They're so much smarter. Bro, this is stupid. There's so many things on me. Melon, just go in the bastion. I'm in there. Bro, that's not a good idea. I'm gonna die instantly. Why don't you just put some gold on? You'll be fine. I got... Ah! Bro. Melon, just put a golden helmet on and they'll be your friend. All right, Sonny. I'm putting a golden helmet on. I got my gold helmet on, Sonny. And you're right. I'm not getting attacked anymore. About time you smartened up, Melon. But these stupid hogs are still attacking me. Don't worry. Just go in the bastion. They're not good at moving around in there. Okay. I'm coming in. Yo, the brute's attacking me. Just kill it. They do so... Oh, Sonny. This is not good. I ticked everyone off by hitting the brute. Sonny. Sonny. Help me. I'm coming. Yo, there's so many hoglins after me. I gotta get something in the chest. Yo, I got something. That counts. I gotta move. One heart. Melon, I'm with you, bro. God. Wait, what the heck? Big Man Melon was slain by Big Man Sonny? Uh, uh, I was trying to save you. I must have hit you on accident. Sorry about that. Bro, what? I didn't even see you near me. I was right there the whole time trying to protect you. I, I, I was... Yeah, that was close. Wow. What? That makes no sense. I didn't see you anywhere. This is so sus. Nah, bro. I was there the whole time. I was just trying to get out of the bastion to help protect you. I'll take your word for it, Sonny. Guess. It's okay. I got tons of loot. I'm gonna bring it back to the overworld and we can upgrade our house. Let's go. That's all I care about anyways. Loot, 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 loot. Let's go. Bring me the loot. Bring me the loot. Okay, guys. I'm gonna come back with an absurd amount of loot. That looks about right. Totally believable. Melon, I'm back, bro. And I got so many goodies from that bastion. Yo, let's see the loot. Let's see the loot. Here you go. You can start decorating the house. Let's go. I'm gonna be so creative with this. Yo. Yo. Dude, how many blocks do you have? Holy crap. Yeah. Yeah, they had a lot of gold in that bastion. It was kind of crazy. <laughs> Decorate the house a bit. No, I don't like that. That doesn't look that good. Yo, guys, Melon is the most gullible person I've ever met. I just threw like 500 gold blocks at him and he didn't even flinch. He just thought I collected that from the bastion. What is wrong with this dude? Dude, this is looking sweet. I'm looking real rich right now. Got that butter. You know what? He deserves this, guys. He absolutely deserves this. I'm morphing into a blaze and I'm gonna burn down everything. Check this out, Sonny. I got gold windows. This is sick. Yo, our house is looking great. What was that? Why is our house on fire? No, put it out. Put it out. Not my beautiful house. What is happening? Melon, what's going on? Why are there so many explosions? Why is there a blaze here? Yo, it must have got through our nether portal. Melon, do you need help? I'm down in the mines right now trying to get diamonds. You need backup. Yeah, I need backup. Help me get this blaze. Why? Why is it burning our house? Bro, it sounds like it's using a flint and steel. What the heck? Ow! It's shooting big explosions at me. This blaze is so weird. Melon, go in the cave. I'll protect you. I gotta get out of here. I gotta... Oh! Oh! I almost burnt to death. Please, get into the cave. Melon, hurry up. Go down in the cave so I can help. I'm almost there. I'm in the caves. Yes. What the heck? Yo, what happened to you, Melon? I got destroyed. Dude, this isn't good. Hurry up and get down there. I want to help. I'm going back in the caves. Yo, stupid skeleton. Get out of here. Yo, why is this blaze here? What the heck? Yo, what is that? That is not a blaze. What the heck is that? You thought it would go unnoticed? I saw you steal my diamonds. Yo, stop it, Sonny. You had so many. It wasn't like that big of a deal. It was. I was trying to get the Guinness World Record for most diamonds in Minecraft, and you ruined it! I'm sorry, Sonny. I'm sorry. Please, you destroyed my house. You took everything. Apologize to this! No! Sonny, was it worth it? You destroyed my chickens, my melons, my entire house, and even your diamonds are everywhere. Look at that. Bruh, you stole one diamond and ruined my world record. So of course it was worth it. What is wrong with you? Stop it! Die! No melons will survive. None! Yes, I've protected them. No! Wait, no. They're still here. Sonny, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? No! Sonny, what are you doing? One more. Just one more. Just... 
One more! No! Now remember, everyone, if you're gonna prank your friends, expect revenge and expect them to also hit that like and subscribe button! In this Minecraft video, I have five minutes to build an epic trap and then Melon has to try and escape it. Ouch! Ah, help, I'm burning! That's because you don't have netherite armor, you doofus! Guys, please subscribe if you want to save me! Yo, Melon, today I'm gonna make the craziest trap and absolutely bamboozle you! Bro, we'll see about that, dude. I've got crazy ideas in my melon. I'm gonna trap you in a trap, in a trap, with another trap. Bro, don't do that! I hate trapceptions! Whatever, bro. You've got five minutes! I'm out of here! First things first, let's enter creative mode. Melon, where'd you go, bro? Where'd you go? I got this blindfold on! I can't see you! Uh, don't worry about it, Sonny. Take your time. No peeking, Sonny, all right? You got it, bro. I'm inside of this house, and your timer starts now. Five minutes on the clock. Yo, what do I want to do as my first trap? Uh, me thinks me have an idea. Let's just build a little bit of a door maze for Sonny. Oh, this is gonna be great. Put the doors down. This is gonna be an awesome first trap. Yes. Place all the doors. Why am I so bad at this? This is not going well. Uh, there. Okay, we got ghost blocks. Let me just redo this whole building. Yes, like this. We shall construct a maze for Sunny. Completely made of bedrock. Yes. Yes. Make the maze. Gotta clear up this bunny. Bunny, get out of here. Gotta clear out the sand a little bit. And here we go. So we'll make the actual exit right about here. And then place some blocks there. And we'll still want to construct his maze here. How about we put some blocks right there? Confuse him a little bit. Yeah, that looks pretty good. And I think my little trap is complete. So Sonny's going to start right here. He's going to be running through this maze looking for the exit. He's going to get so confused. But the exit's actually right here. And to top it all off, I'm gonna put a bunch of creepers in here! He's gonna be so dusted. No way he survives my trap. Alright, Sonny, are you ready? Melon, I've been waiting so long, bro. Are you almost done your build? Yeah, I'm ready. Are you ready to get teleported, though? Hold on, let me take my blindfold off. Put it in this chest. Okay, bro. I'm ready. Send me over. In three, two, one, go! Ah! Yo, what? <sighs> I'm actually alive. Sonny, you gotta solve this maze, all right? Bruh. Wait, I have the solution right here. It's like this, like this. No, Sonny, you're not supposed to do that. No, what are you doing? What are you doing? Yo, there's so many creepers, Melon. I'm alive. I'm actually alive. I'm actually alive. Blow up over there. Blow up away from me. No, you're not supposed to escape like this. No, this is not how it's supposed to work. You're supposed to die. Let me up. How do I get out of this place? No, creeper. Creeper, go away. Escape the creepers. Dude, there's no way out. What is this? Yeah. Uh, no! Yo, you put ghost blocks? How did you survive my trap, bro? You were supposed to die. Absolutely goaded. What was this garbage melon? I thought the creepers would explode and I didn't think about the sand and then... Oh, my. That was not smart. I didn't think about it too much. Bruh, I almost did die. I have two hearts left. That was so close. Close. Wait, you have two hearts left? Melon, Melon, chill. Whatever you're thinking, no! I guess my trap worked out in the end. If you call slapping me with a netherite axe your trap working out, that is so unfair. Uh, well, I guess it's unfair then. Bruh, just go inside of this house, open the chest, put the blindfold on, and prepare to lose. All right, bro. You got two minutes to make your trap. Okay, that's plenty of time. Plenty of time. Okay, guys, I'm in creative mode, and again, Get this trap started why don't we just grab ourselves some really fun tnt like maybe some of this maybe some ooh, vaporized tnt that sounds pretty nice and then let's just go under where melon's hiding and be like boom bang bing bop shoo bing and a little vaporizers oh yeah this melon is finished that's what he gets for trolling me he thinks he can get away with that think again bro think again and then I'm just gonna go like this and get 
a normal TNT, like here and like here. So he has kind of a chance to get away. Nah, I'm not giving him a chance. Give Sonny barriers. There we go. And then let's seal him in. No escape. <laughs> this is gonna be so funny. And then check this out. I'm gonna go pressure plate like this. Oh, wait, let me just get in the cracks here. Oh, wait, the slab. Whatever, we'll do this. It's fine, it's fine. Pressure plate there. We're gonna get a little bit of redstone wiring like this. And now he's gonna detonate that TNT the second he comes out of here. And let's just finish these barriers off so he doesn't escape. Beautiful. That's what he deserves. Now, let me make my real trap. And for this, all I've got to do is go way down to bedrock layer. Okay, I found the perfect location. Now I just need to grab some drill TNT, a flint and steel, and let's open this up. Actually, let's use some dynamite too. Boom. <laughs> that worked perfectly. So now I've got this big open space of bedrock. Let's just tidy it up a little bit, and I'll show you what I'm going to do to melon. Yeah, that should be good right here. Now we just need to open up a three by three three. Beautiful. There it is. The void. That's what's gonna destroy Melon. Now I just need a fence, a lead, chicken egg, and some boats. This is gonna be perfect. I just gotta go like this. And now I'm making a name tag to call my chicken Eduardo. Because you know like in Ed, Ed, and Eddie, they're all called Ed, so I want my chicken to be called Eduardo because they love chicken there. And then I go like this, like that. Eduardo. And I attach him, and I I'll push him into the void. Go, Eduardo. Be free. No, ow, oh, not me, Eduardo. You into the void. Don't make me hit you, bro. What is your deal? Just go, go down. It's safe down there. I put a lead on you. Oh, thank you. And now I just gotta let him flutter a little bit until he goes perfectly centered up. It's gonna be fine, Eduardo. Chill out, bro. Chill out, dude. Why is he freaking out like this? Whatever. This better work. Now I take some fences. Oh no, Eduardo. No, Eduardo. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, mistakes were made. I need a new Eduardo. Let me do this. There he is. He's so handsome. And then check this out. I gotta be quick with it. I gotta break that. Let him start to fall. Then I gotta go like, Eduardo, come back. Was that, was that too slow? No, he's good. He's perfect. And now he's all centered up too. This is what we needed. And now I can make this work. I just need some temporary slabs. Check this out. And then I take my boats and I sail. And I set sail perfectly aligned into the cracks. Like like this. Just gotta crush my boat in there. Do that two more times. Yes, the perfect platform. Beautiful. And now I just gotta, oh, not punch the boat. Gotta turn hitboxes on. I don't want to punch my boat, so I gotta get the perfect angle underneath it, and bang! Knock the slab out. It's working, guys! We just need more boats! Oh, it's beautiful. It's looking so good. Next one. Yes, let's go! Last boat! Do it! Let's Let's go! Now, I break these. I don't need them anymore. And I have a perfect void base for Melon to land in. Let's just put these away. And it's time for me to clear my inventory and let Melon know he can come to my trap. But before I teleport Melon here, I want to watch him explode when he tries to leave that house. Melon, I'm ready! About time, Sonny, bro. Let me just put this blindfold away. And what the why are there barrier blocks? No! You're so dead! What is this? Yo, I can escape! No! Yeah, escape? How do you think you're gonna escape? Sonny, you destroyed the whole village. So why are the witches here? Don't get cursed, Melon! Run away from them! Ah! So, Melon, that wasn't even my real trap. Do you want to see my real trap? How was that not your real trap, Sonny? Bro, I just exploded and died. <laughs> <laughs> that was just my troll, bro. I'm gonna teleport you to my real trap now. You ready? Uh, no, I'm about to die. All right, then I'll save you. TP Big Man Melon to Big Man Sunny. Here you go. Uh, what the heck is this, Sunny? That's my trap for you. <laughs> nice one. What just happened? I just got kicked. You're cheating, probably. <laughs> What the heck? You just exploded. No, no, not this. Teleport me quick. The witches are after me. Here you go. Ah! 
Melon, you ruined the trap! What the heck is that trap, Sonny? I wanted to make you stranded inside the void. How did you mess my boats up? Uh, wait, you built something in the void? How'd you do that? Well, you've ruined it. Now you'll never know. Oh, well. I guess your trap failed. No, you died twice, bro. First to the TNT and then to the void. So my trap definitely worked. I just wanted it to torture you longer. Fine, bro. Your traps are better than mine. I get it. Thanks, bruh. Feels good to get a compliment like that. Okay, Melon, it's your turn to build a cool trap. You got five minutes. I'm gonna be chilling down here at the bedrock. All right, dude. Time to build an epic trap. Just gotta think about what I wanna do right now. All right, guys. I have just the trap laid out for Sonny. Just gotta build out a little house really quickly for him. Yeah, that looks good. Build it up a little bit. He's gonna be so happy because it's made out of gold blocks and gold's his favorite block. So he's gonna think I'm being nice, probably. Build this up. Yeah, this looks pretty good. Oh, no, no, no. I gotta make it a little bit skinnier. So this should do the trick. Yeah, that looks pretty good. And here's what I'm gonna do. So first things first, I gotta grab me some pistons. That out a little bit. That out. Give myself some sticky pistons. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Set them up over here as well. I just realized I messed these pistons up. I'm not the redstone goat. Go build these blocks. And now it's time time to construct my pit of doom. Yes! Sonny thinks he can kill me in the void. I'm gonna kill him with something far worse than he could imagine. Just gotta dig it out a little bit. And what do I want to destroy Sonny with? So I'm gonna place one say goodbye TNT right here. And the rest of this is just gonna be covered in normal sandstone. Not suspicious at all. Except this one right here is gonna be a secret pressure plate. So Sonny's gonna fall into this pit. He's gonna survive, think he's okay, start clowning, start goofing on me, but then he's gonna press this secret pressure plate, and you're near say goodbye, and he's gonna explode! Now, I just gotta set up the sticky pistons. And now my trap is completed. Just gotta add this, though. Trapped chest, and let's add in some golden blocks for Sunny. Yeah, he can get, uh, he can get two stacks of golden blocks. My trap's gonna work out perfect Guys, and you might be wondering, oh, that trap chest doesn't work. Uh, that's because I want to be the one to do the deed myself. I want to pull the lever and destroy Sonny. Totally not because I couldn't figure it out. All right, Sonny, you ready? Yes, bro. It's been like a hundred years. I'm ready to bust your trap. All right, big guy. Come. Oh, wait. Sorry. Did the command wrong. Come here. Yo, what is this? This is the tiniest little box. Wait. Are some of these ghost blocks? Hold up. Let me just make sure this is all safe. Yo, this is all safe. Wait, Melon? What? There's nothing sus with the chest, bro. I don't know why you're being weird. You really think I'm this stupid? I could tell this is a trap chest, bro. It has that little red outline on the buckle. Sonny, it does nothing. Trust me. You sure? I promise you. I promise you. I bet you 5,000 diamonds it does nothing. I don't want to take that bet. This seems like a scam. You're just trying to get my diamonds. You know what? I'll trust you. And I'll be safe safe about it. I'm gonna stand on the chest. <laughs> Got him. Yo! Two stacks of golden blocks? No way, Melon! No freaking way! You're so nice, bro! Yep, uh, this wasn't a trap at all, Sonny. It was just me being really nice to you. Bro, why would you do this? Oh, I forgot to take the pit out! No! Okay, thanks, Melon! Sonny, Sonny, no, no. You're supposed to go down. No, Sonny. I can fill this whole pit with gold. You gave me so much. No, get down! Get back in there! You ruined everything! You gave me so much wealth and riches. I will build my way out with solid gold. <laughs> oh, ow! Sonny, you ruined my trap, bruh. Come back here. What do you mean? I'm scooping all this gold blocks up and you're coming back to me. Okay, now what? Figure out how to escape, Sonny. There's one way out. Is there a- Hey! What the heck was that? Why? No. No! <laughs> yeah! Are you serious? Yes! I've done it! Bro, not the Rick Roll TNT. Rick rolled, Sonny. You got Rick rolled. Sure!
say goodbye. All right, Sonny, you got five minutes to build your trap. You better make it cool. Oh, I will. I've got a great idea this round. Let's go. Okay, guys, for this round, I've got such a stupid trap idea. It's gonna be brilliant. I'm gonna troll the heck out of Melon with this. Now, I just wanna find a little tiny cave. This is perfect down here. Then I'm gonna close it off. I don't want these mobs trying to kill me. So let's grab some black stone. That'll look pretty cool. I actually really like this block. Get out of here, skeleton. I'm trying to build here. Cover the whole wall up. Then I need some torches. It's too dark down here. Yes, light it up. It's beautiful. Then I'm gonna come up to the surface and do the same thing. Gotta block this so there's no way out. Except for this here keypad door. That'll be the only way out of here. And the passcode is gonna be 54321. Sorry, I, I will stop the, the singing. That was kind of cringe. My bad. Apologies, please. Forgive me. So that's the passcode, 54321. One. But Melon will never guess that password. So what's gonna happen is I'm actually going to flood this thing with pigmen. So many of them. They're so beautiful. And zombified pigs. This is beautiful. And then before I teleport Melon down here, I'm gonna give him a golden item so they don't automatically attack him. But what I'm gonna do that's gonna be so funny is I'm gonna have this piece of paper and I'm gonna convince Melon that the passcode's written on it and that I've morphed into one of these pigs. So let's do that really fast. Perfect. So Melon's gonna have to try and figure out which pig is me. The only problem is, as soon as he punches one of these pigs, they're all gonna attack him. And the best part is, I'm gonna do this. So I'll actually be in spectator mode and it'll be impossible for him to find me. Let's do this. Okay, Melon, I'm ready. Step out of that house. About time, son. I swear if I explode again, I'm gonna be really mad. No, you're not gonna explode. <laughs> Oh, what the heck? This is me, bro. <laughs> Yo, what are you up to? For my trap, you're gonna want to put this golden helmet on. Trust me on that one. Okay, you're being weird right now. Why are you a zombified pigment? It'll all make sense in a second. Then I'm gonna teleport you into an area where the only way out is to open a keypad security door. But the password is protected by zombified piglins. You're gonna have to find me amongst all of the fakes. If you can't kill me and get the password you're gonna be trapped forever and keep dying over and 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 over shut up what let's just do this thing brother can i get an axe or something to like kill you faster sure yeah i'll even give you this because it's kind of fitting five pork chops hey that's pretty disrespectful all right Teleport me. Okay, guys, I'm in the lair with all of my pig friends. And now I'm going to go into spectator to troll Melon. But wait, let me just scroll off of this so he doesn't see a flying paper. That would be cringe. Okay, Melon, don't forget that golden helmet and make sure you set your spawn point as soon as you get here. All right, spawn point. Okay. Bro, what the heck? There's so many of them. This one's looking at me funny, dude. I don't know. And he's got a potion effect on him. Yo, good luck finding me. If you want this password, there's only one way to get it. You're gonna have to punch one of these pigs. Yo. Oh, this is not gonna be good. There's so many of them. I must make some preparations if I want to survive. Which one do you think is me, Melon? Uh, I think you're the one. No, these guys are bots. That guy's clearly a bot. This dude's a bot. Yo, this one's being sus. I think this one's you! Ah! It wasn't you! You're so dead, bro! Swarm Brothers! No! Yo, oh wait, I'm chill again. They're cool with me now. Wait, where's my diamond axe? Good luck with this, Melon! Uh, I don't like this, Sonny! Wait, give me some gravel. I know what to do. If I can just make myself a little hole. Give me some of this. Give me some of this. What are you trying to do, bro? Don't worry about it. I got this down, bro. I don't think you do. I really don't. I think this is gonna end in disaster and it's gonna be really funny. Nah, dude. I'm big chilling. Go 
here. And I need one more piece of gravel. Okay. Well, of course I get flint now. Are you kidding me? Let's see this big plan. Uh, I'm gonna need to hit one of them. We gotta run! Run! Yes! No, the babies! I forgot about the babies! I knew the little ones would fly in there. Oh, no. He's got arrows. How am I getting hit? They got crossbows, dude. I'm slaughtering them! I'm slaughtering them all! One of them's wearing your head! There's a mini melon out here! No way! I can just destroy- Oh, oh. What the heck? How did they hit me? Ah, uh, he wall hacked you. Get wrecked. It's okay. This. Oh my god, there is a mini melon. It's okay. I can still win this. Just gotta get back to my spot. Yo, throw your melon head at one of them. Yeah. Oh, he didn't even wear it. That's disrespectful. Get in, get in, get in. Melon, are you enjoying my trap? Bro, how am I getting hit sometimes? It's so stupid, bro. There's so many. Yo, I'm killing the mini melon. Come on. Just got to destroy all of them. You're doing great, bro. You're doing great. How are these guys not dead? No, my brother, stop dying. He's gonna get the password. Keep dying. I'm going to find this password. Sonny. Bro, your strategy is actually working. This is not cool. This is very cool. Are you kidding me? You were supposed to die way more than this. I'm too goaded, Sonny. I'm too goaded to die. Yes! I've defeated all of the- Bro, not a single one had the passcode! What is this? I- I- uh, Hey, Melon. I- I- I might have switched to the spectator mode. You looking for this? Bro, you're a dirty cheat. Go in survival. Go in survival, you coward. Okay, here. I'll go in survival. I'll even set my spawn point. Here, kill me. Yes. Give me it. What is it? Pa paper. It's it's paper. Are you kidding me? Bro, what is this passcode? One, two, three, four, five, six. <sighs> Melon. What is this? Hey, because you did such a good job trying to get the password from those piglins, I'll tell you it. It's called five, four, three, two, one. I make that melon go mm da da. No! I guess that means my trap worked. Comment which trap you thought was the best right now. And like and subscribe. Why can't I hit you? Why are you still in creative, bro? Oh, sorry about that. You can punch me now. Well, bam, bam. I'm punching you, Sonny. And make sure you guys like and subscribe quick before melon drowns in an ocean of lava! No! Chill! Oh, I missed. I missed. I can't be having that. Yeah! Oh, no. Oh, no. I gotta go! I gotta go! This is a $1,000 Minecraft build battle, but I turned invisible in order to troll Melon and win every time! And if you guys comment pumpkin emojis, I'll turn Melon's build into a giant pumpkin! Why did my Melon build turn into a pumpkin? I hate pumpkins! <laughs> Get trolled, bro! Hey, yo! Oh, melon! It's time for me to boop, bop, slap you! Chill! No, you're getting off. You're getting off. You're getting off. You're getting off. Nope, you're getting off. No, I'm the best at this. I'm a spleef king. Oh, we're both dead. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Melon. Look what you did. Now we both died, Sonny. Now I gotta fly all the way back up here. Yeah, but now I can destroy the water, Melon! Yes. Worth it. How could you have done this? I don't even care about the gold block. I'm still beautiful with or without it. Whatever, Sonny. Round one, we have to create a famous landmark. Oh, I'm going on my side. Nice, nice. Really nice. I don't even know whose side is who, so you take that one. I'm gonna jump the other way and make the most famous, most epic landmark from any time in history that you can build, Melon, okay? The competition is worth 10,000 Minecraft diamonds! Don't mess up! Okay, chill! I already know some of you are commenting, Sonny, don't cheat this time! Just build for real and beat Melon! But guys, what would be the fun in that? Trolling Melon and making him angry is way more funny! So I've got some new tricks up my sleeve today. But first things first, let me grab my schematic. Now I've got my schematic loaded. All I got to do is hit paste and look at it. I paid a professional builder to make one of the best, most beautiful landmarks of the modern era. It's the Statue of Villergy. Yeah, it's the Statue of Liberty. Minecraft edition. Look at her in all of her liberty glory. I had to pay $20 for this. So you guys better like the video right now. Thank you. Guys, I'm not gonna lie i'm struggling a little bit to make my build i'm trying to create the great pyramids of giza but i can't build pyramids man this is gonna take forever plus i don't even think it's gonna line up at the top oh what the heck am i supposed to do wait is there like a world edit command i can use here uh... wait there is i can do pyramid wait 
Hold on a second. Lego pyramid, Minecraft, sandstone, and then I do like 20. Oh God, what did I do? I gotta go in spectator. What did I just create? Yo, I just created a perfect pyramid. Wait a second. I'm gonna actually be able to create my build no problemo. Okay guys, while Melon's working on his build, I'm gonna go in creative mode and grab a beautiful invisibility potion and splash myself. Now I'm perfectly hidden. Melon will have no clue that I'm on his side of the map. So let's go check out what he's built. Yo, he's working on the pyramids of geezer. Because he's an old geezer, get it? He actually is. He's like the oldest watermelon of all time. Let's not even cap about it. But let's see what else he's doing. Yo, he made a tiny little pyramid over there too. What is he doing? Yo, what's Melon up to? Bro, he just spawned a third pyramid. He's got three different sizes. I'm not even even gonna troll guys he's doing a pretty good job with his builds okay guys now that i have the pyramids built it's time for me to make myself a sphinx uh what am i gonna grab here i'm gonna need some sandstone some yellow concrete I'm gonna pull up a picture of the sphinx on the side i ain't even gonna cap this is gonna be hard i'm gonna give it my best shot yo guys it looks like melon's working on another build in the meantime while he's distracted let's take a look at all the custom modded tnt Cam Chemical TNT, compact TNT. This looks pretty fun. Annoying. You know I like this one. <gasps> Butter TNT. I can make his pyramid so much more beautiful by turning it into gold. Just gotta craft out the paws a little bit. That looks pretty good if I do say so myself tunneling TNT. I bet I could drill a hole straight through his pyramid with that. And then I want to grab my favorite one. The say goodbye. This is the Rick Roll TNT. And now I just have to go to work. Let's put some chemicals at the top first. Everyone likes a good bit of chemicals to clean up their pyramid. Uh, guys, that was the wrong one. <laughs> I hope Mela doesn't look up. What happened to my pyramid? That's it. I'm unmuting in Discord. Sonny, what did you do to my build? I'm not sure what you're talking about. I'm trying to work on my statue build right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Trying to work on your statue build, huh? Okay. That's real cool, Sonny. That's real cool. Yeah, what do you mean? I'm just trying to build a cool Statue of Liberty monument. You know what? I won't cheat. I won't cheat. But I'm throwing something over the wall. What did you just do? What the heck? Why is my build changing? Guys, it looks like he missed. He just missed my build. It's alive. But don't tell him that. I'm gonna freak out and pretend he broke my build. Dang it, Melon! You blow up half of my build! That's what you get for blowing up my build, Sonny. You scumbag. I don't know how you did it, but you are trolling me somehow. I didn't do anything, bro. Why are you being so mean to me? Shut up. You know you did something. That's it, goats. Time to use the tunneling TNT. And I'm aiming it right at Melon. I hope this goes and blasts him. Yo! Yo! What the heck happened to my build? <laughs> it worked. That's it, Sonny. I'm throwing another dynamite over. You can't be playing with me. Dude, you can't just dynamite me because you're annoyed. The game's glitching. Chill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go, buddy. Melon! Melon, stop! I hope... Your build got absolutely destroyed. Dude, you blew up my entire structure. Why? You deserve it, Sonny. Yes! Karma, huh? How do you like it? Oh, I really enjoyed it. Thanks. And now, check this out. I just gotta fly around the side, place a little one of these, and say goodbye, Melon. Wait, wait, wait. First, I'm gonna attract him by using the annoying TNT. What the heck is going on? on no why are these tnts getting detonated no <laughs> yes it worked melon why is the chat saying that you said goodbye sonny stop trolling so hard i don't even have any time left no there's 10 seconds bro you'll be fine it's okay my build got completely destroyed you scumbag what are you talking about bro why do i hear a vacuum now. Wait, you hear a vacuum cleaner? That's weird. Sunny, I guess both of our builds are destroyed. Are you kidding?
kidding me? What? You missed. Look at the crater you made, though. <laughs> My god, and you totally cheated to spawn this in, too. What the heck? Not only are you spawning things in, but you're destroying my builds now. Why are you accusing me of spawning this in? I only paid a builder $20 to make this. Oh my god, that's even worse, bro. There's even an inside to it. Isn't it awesome? Dude, that is so awesome, Sonny. Wow. Good for you, bro. I'm so proud of you. You're crazy. What are you doing? I'm not doing anything. Melon? Melon, chill. Melon, think about- You oh, killed her. You killed the statue of Villergy. No, don't worry. Its head's still there. There's nothing left! Don't worry. There's still some bricks. There's no bricks left. There's just a hole in the ground. Don't worry. There's still some dirt. Okay, Melon, it's enough. You don't have to be so salty that you lost the first round. <sighs> You're such a cheater! Well, I guess, what do you think about my build? Your build looks a lot like you. Trash. What the heck, man? Let's just go to the next round. Hey, Melon! The theme of the second round is farm animals! Farm animals? Yeah, bruh. Okay, sounds good. Okay, guys, since Sunny cheated in the first round, I'm gonna do a little bit of cheating. If I type in this command right here and just paste something in, boom! I have my very own farm now i just gotta add some farm animals give me some cows some chickens what else do i want sheep hey let's even add some goats oh they don't got goats okay this should be good spread the love okay guys let's see what melon's up to on his side just gotta go invisible and take a peek around this corner it's only been about one minute into the build contest and melon already has this he thinks he can get away with using schematics. I'm supposed to be the cheater, not him. That's it. I'm gonna prepare the ultimate prank. All I need is an anvil and a name tag. Collect my Johnny tag. And then I grab some Vindicator spawn eggs. Let's do this. Sneak past him to the back end of his barn right around here. Yes. Dig a quick little hole in the ground and spam it. Spam the Vindicators. This should be enough. Then name them all Johnny. Yes. Come, my army. Get bigger. Then I splash them with invisibility and release them. Yes. Come this way, my Vindicators. This way. And I unleash them on Melon's farm. Look at it go. <laughs> His animals, they're all going to get chopped. What's going on? Why do I... Why are my cows getting chopped up? Why is there a floating axe? What is happening? That's it. Netherite axe. I need to stop this. They're all getting destroyed. What the heck? Where'd this thing go? Yo, I can see its particles. <laughs> Look at this. His whole farm is getting slaughtered. Is that a vindicator? That's it. Going in survival mode. I'll take them out myself. Yeah. Ow! They hurt! They hurt! Oh, I did it! I killed them! What the heck? Dude, are there any more of those guys? Ow! What the heck? No! 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 Come on! No! Ow! Yo! He got slaughtered by Johnny! Bro, who is Johnny? What is going on? Dude, I need to spawn more! Please tell me there's no more Johnnies! What the heck? I can see his stupid floating axe again! Dude, I need to take care of this guy! <laughs> this might be my favorite prank ever! It's just a floating iron axe destroying Melon! Ow! Ah! And then his animals too! It's destroying everything. Sonny, how much time is left? I'm getting destroyed by Johnny. I don't understand who this guy is. You have two minutes left, Melon. Uh, guys, the invisibility wore off. All the vindicators are visible. Johnny's a vindicator? Wait a second. Sonny, are you behind this? I gotta go. I gotta go. I'm going back to my side, guys. I'm going back to my side. And then I gotta create my barn quick before Melon gets over here. Paste. Why are there so many vindicators? And why are they all named Johnny? That's it. I'm cleaning them up. This is over for them. And there it is. My barn. It's beautiful. I just got to fill it with animals. I got to fill it with animals quick. I want a horse spawn egg, a cow, some piggies, and sheep. Oh, I'm going to dye my sheep too. This is a little cow patch. We got horses in here. I got the horses in the back. This is a pig pen, guys. Trust me. And then we got our sheepsies. And check this out. Dye. I'm going to make green for melon, red for melon, and
and yellow for me. Beautiful. Two yellow sheep as well. And then in this last pen, I'm gonna do something really weird. It's a frog farm. <laughs> Trust me, these are totally normal frogs. Nothing weird about this at all. Melon, are you done your build yet, bro? Hold on, I gotta spawn something exotic in. Yo, wait, what? Chill. Chill, chill. And then in the front of my barn, guys, there's just gonna be chickens everywhere. Surrounded, surrounded in delicious, nutritious chicken. Okay, I'd say that's pretty good. That's a lot of chickens. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. Yeah? Do you want to check out my build first or yours? Uh, let's check out yours first. Okay, come to the wall. Come to the wall. Hey, Sonny. Hey, dude. Why are you invisible? I don't know what you're talking about. You don't? Hey, chill! Look, I'm not invisible. I'm not invisible. See? Where'd you go? Everything's, everything's normal, bro. Hey, what's up with all these chickens, though? Dude, don't TNT my chickens. <laughs> Look at them. I don't know what chickens you're talking about, bro. I don't even see a single one on your base. Mel Melon, Melon, just go look at my barn. Stop it. You're flinging my farm animals everywhere. It's not cool. Okay, I'm checking out. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> just go inside. I got horses. This is actually a really cool barn, it, Sonny. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. Wait, what the heck is this? Bro, you got a toad room? Yo. Yeah, these are my froggies. You like them? I can just sit on toad chairs? Yeah, dude, they're frogs. Relax, show them respect. And you didn't even notice my sheep. Oh, they're so cute. You got a second floor too? You got any animals up here? No, but you have your own little living space. Hay bales, chest. This is actually quite the cute farm, Sonny. And I can kind of believe you did this. Well, I did. So what do you mean kind of? I don't know. I kind of do. But I still think you probably spawned it in. Bro, I know you cheated. How do you know I cheated? Wouldn't you have to cheat to know I cheated? I have a feeling you cheated is what I meant to say. So if you cheated to know I cheated, you're just as guilty as me, if not more guilty than I am. Whatever, dude. Bro, why am I invisible? Wait, you were behind the Johnnies, weren't you? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know anyone named Johnny. Oh, I'm on the very top. I'm on the very top. Yo, Melon, your barn is crazy. You have mushrooms? Yeah, bro, check it out. I didn't see any mushrooms in your barn. And you have flowers and trees? I'm gonna give you credit where credit's due. You made a pretty nice barn. I paid a lot of attention to detail, you feel me? I feel you. No, enough with the Johnnies. Go away, Johnnies. Hey, now all your farm animals are dead. Nice one. A small sacrifice to make for the herd to survive. Melon, for the third build competition, let's see who can make the best house. Yo, I got this down, Pat. <laughs> this is my specialty. No peeking and no cheating, especially. Okay, guys, for my game plan, I'm just gonna use one of these TNTs and make myself a really pathetic little brick house because I don't even care about this round. I totally won the first two, so I want to give Melon a chance, but mostly, I just want to troll him. <laughs> so let me grab an invisibility potion for eight minutes. Slap that on and yeah look at his house oh it's so cool it's so nice let me put a couple extra invisibility potions for later in here that looks good and i think the only other stuff i'm gonna need is a world edit wand now let's go spy on the melon this is looking fire so far i'm liking what i'm seeing yo guys he's just made a tiny little entrance to his house he's barely started this looks like a good start to the house Yo, Melon's house is coming along pretty dang well so far. It'd be a real shame if something were to happen to it. All right, guys, time to decorate the interior a little bit. <laughs> Gotta get my netherite sink out, of course, the classic netherite drawer, just in case, you know, my house explodes for whatever reason. And look, it even functions as a chest. This is sick. Bunch of cabinets on this wall. Yep. Gotta have a netherite oven. How are you gonna cook? That looks pretty sick. And let's get a crafting table. And furnace. Yep, this looks pretty sleek and cozy. Time to make the second floor. Just gotta build it up from the sides. Okay, guys, this is my time to strike. Melon's gone upstairs. He's working on floor two. Yo, what has he done in here? This man has an obsession with netherite cabinetry. What is going on? You know what? I'm gonna fill this one with invisibility potions, see if he notices. And then I gotta break this block and go underneath. It's time to flood it with lava. And in case that's not enough. I have my world edit wand. Let's go up here and we're gonna do this. Click that. Click that. Set 
lava. Oh, that's plenty. Oh, this is gonna be good. It's all gonna burn. Just gotta go outside and wait for Melon to realize his house is on fire. Yeah, this looks pretty good. Oh, I like this. Wait, what the heck? Why is my house burning? Why is the whole first floor on fire? Oh, this is not good. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I need water. I need water right now. I need water right now. <laughs> Yo, if he puts water, it's gonna turn everything to obsidian. That's kind of cool, maybe. Bro, get rid of all this flame this is not good but now his house is just flooded it's so ugly bro what the heck just happened my house it's still on fire it's like pompeii melon are you good i hear you freaking out over there bro my house is burning down what did you do sonny nothing but i hear there's a lot of volcanic activity in this area bro this is such cap i can't even put it out with all this water bro there's probably a volcanic eruption underneath your house bro did i did i get rid of all the fire i think i did it oh bro my building's ruined guys mela's house is so ugly now time to give him a one minute warning hey melon there's only one minute left wait what do you mean there's only one minute left my house just got destroyed that sounds like a personal problem dude are you kidding me i can't even drain it in time wait i need sponges Give me the sponges. Yes, I can do it. I'm doing it. Is there any more water right here? He hasn't noticed. There's still lava underneath his home. Yes. Wait, there's still lava. It's underneath the sink. Are you kidding me? And now, guys, game mode survival. Big man melon set lava. No! What the heck? Are you kidding me? Melon, what happened? Did the volcano erupt? You are such a scumbag, Sonny. I'll show you a volcano. I gotta get back to my house and clear my effects. Wanna talk about a volcano, huh, Sonny? Melon, the time's up. Let's just review the builds. Let's review the builds, all right? Let's review yours first, Sonny. Okay, take a look. I built this nice contemporary brick house. It's small, it's quaint, but it's beautiful. Oh, that's weird that you got no volcanoes erupting here. That is quite interesting. I'm a meteorologist. I made sure to check all of the landscapes before I constructed my home. Dude, my house got destroyed. Wait, what's that? Bro, what, what's going on? Oh no. Melon, what is it? Melon, what have you just done? What what have you done? This is too much! What have you done? Look up in the air! You should have checked the landscape! You just erupted Pompeii onto the entire Minecraft world! Well, I guess this round's a draw. I, I think, um, you lose disqualification. Hey, you did the same thing to me. You were trolling me the whole time. What? No, no evidence whatsoever of trolling was seen. I was minding my own business on my side of the map, and you just lit off a whole volcano. Call it a draw. No more shenanigans. This is the final round. Whoever wins it wins everything. Let's go. Wait, creative mode, please. Yes, clutched it. Yeah, me too, me too. Oh, no, not spectator. Not survival. Oh, that was a photo finish clutch. That was crazy. Hey, Melon, uh, the theme of this competition, where are you, bruh? Yeah, well, I'm right here, Sonny. The theme, according to my calculations, is uh, skyscrapers. And I've got a really cool build in mind. I'm gonna make the tallest, coolest building ever. Bye. I've got a cool build. I got a blueprint for it. All right, guys. Since Sonny's been messing with me, cheating, and trolling this whole time, I'm gonna head into the TNTs. I grabbed myself a little TNT that spawns in a few houses. Check this out, guys. Please don't go over the wall. Yes, this is perfect. Not only do I have my own building, I have my own city. Spawn in a few more, and and that should be enough to secure the dub. Uh, Melon, why are there houses coming through the wall? Don't worry about it. I'm just a very quick and efficient builder, all right? This is like sus times infinity, bro. This is the weirdest, most obvious cheating. What are you doing? I'm not doing anything, bro. I'm just playing the game. Can we just play, guys? 
Okay, chill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just play the game too then. I'm just playing the game. Give me a second to just play the game. Okay, guys. I hired a builder to also construct this. It cost me a little more than $20. He built me the most insane mansion skyscraper you've ever seen. There's a helicopter pad. There's a rooftop pool. This thing is crazy. Yo, I can't wait for Melon to see this. He's actually going to be impressed and he's going to want to play hide and seek and he's gonna be like wow sonny you're so cool how did you build all that and i'll be like yeah bro i invest in my builds i'm an architect all right sonny i'm ready if you are yeah i'd say my luxury skyscraper is looking pretty close to completed let me just put the finishing touches yeah that looks just about right okay it's done yo what the heck did you build i decided to take this car competition pretty seriously melon so i reinvested my rewards from last time and hired a super architect to make me a luxury skyscraper hotel this looks rather pasted in sunny what do you mean just weird that like these blocks are conveniently one block high i don't know man i don't know it wasn't me it was the builders though so it's cool bruh this is insane though do these elevators work uh yeah you just have to go in creative mode and fly Oh, that's kind of lame. But this is insane. Yo, it goes on forever. You actually went all out on this build. How much did this cost you? I don't want to talk about it. I might have gone on to one of those build discords and paid $100 for this. Bro, you paid $100 for this? <laughs> You trash, bro. It's the same thing. Copy and paste it. Wait, what do you mean? This floor is the same as the floor below. It's the same as the floor below. It's the same as the floor below. Are you kidding me? I got scammed? Yeah, you got scammed hardcore, my dude. Bro, be careful when you commission things, guys. They might be using the same build a hundred times. It still looks really cool, though. Check out my build, though. It is totally not the same thing over and over again. Every structure is completely unique. Check it out, Sonny. Dude, this is the most hideous skyscraper I've ever seen. It's a monster, bro. Bro, it has tons of rooms. It has even more rooms than your build. Yeah, but it looks like it's growing things out of itself. What do you mean? Guys, vote whose build was better. Melons or Sonny's? I think mine was better. Well, let's let the comments section decide our fate. Who wins the 10,000 Minecraft diamonds? Is it Melons' ugly splattered up town or my beautiful scam skyscraper? skyscraper. I don't know, Sonny, but what I do know is that I'm about to set this place on fire. Wait, why? What is that, Melon? Melon, what are you holding? What is that TNT called? Don't worry about it. Don't even know what this is. It looks like a coral reef. Yeah, I don't really know what it's gonna do either. We're gonna see, though. You just destroyed the ground. That was it? That was pretty anticlimactic. Melon, that was so lame that I'm constructing you a new custom TNT sphere. It's all all for you. No, Sonny. Chill. I'm far away. There's no way. No. What the heck? Why am I in survival? And Melon, we're going down together. Game mode survival. Big man, Sonny. Yes. Oh, no. Oh, no. I think I'm safe on the wall. Ow. Oh, wait. It's, it's still exploding, Melon. It's still exploding. Oh, wait. No, we're good. Hey, it stopped. Today in Minecraft, I use the infinity gauntlet to freeze time and troll my friend melon sonny you dirty cheat <laughs> get frozen noob goats please subscribe right now to unpause me three two one uh, oh no melon stop melon it's been a hard day's work but we need more lumber if we're gonna keep cooking all of our beef all right, I'll cut down some trees, Sonny. Relax. Do all the hard work while you do nothing. What do you mean nothing? I'm about to breed cows and then slaughter them. This is so sad. Well, well, whatever. I got to cut down a tree. And that's very labor intensive. Okay, guys, I just got to farm up these cows so that we have lots of food for our next adventure. And boom, slice, dice. I've got to turn into a villain for this. Die! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, that's enough. 
That's enough beef for one day. Gathering up these trees and guys, Sunny doesn't know this, but I'm just going to put on some goggles of true vision and I have a secret hideout right next to this tree. Just got to go in. What is Melon doing? He just went underground. Bruh, he's supposed to be cutting down this forest, but he's gone into a secret base. Okay, I got to pretend I didn't see that. Uh, uh, I'm just farming cows. Okay, guys, check out my secret base. Just got to enter the code 6969 enter and look at these laser beams scan and just like that my security has been disabled enter my epic loot room <laughs> i've got so many diamonds and so much gold i bet you sunny wish he had this but he doesn't it's all mine Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Anyways, I'm just gonna grab a few diamonds and some netherite. And in this barrel over here, <laughs> I've got a bunch of wood. I don't even have to work at all. It feels so good. And now time to leave and reactivate my security. And now my security is reactivated. Hopefully Sonny didn't see me. Okay, he's looking the other way. And nothing ever happened. Melon, do you have that wood yet? We need fuel, bro. I got so much raw beef to cook. Don't worry, bro. I took down practically the entire forest. Check it out. You need wood? You need wood, Sonny? Yo. How did you harvest this much wood? I saw you, Melon. You chopped one tree. I chopped at least two, so it could be like two or like a thousand. Probably closer to a hundred. Whatever, dude. I'm not questioning it. I'm just gonna fuel our stuff. Put those all in, and then put that. And our smoker is gonna cook forever. Sonny, don't worry about the meats. I will handle it from now on. Give me all the food. Yes! Melon, you're scaring me. Huh? I'm out of here, bruh. I'm going on my own adventure. That's fine, Sonny. Honestly, Honestly, I'm pretty full. I'm gonna go take a nap. Food coma. All right, bro. Enjoy your snooze. I'm gonna explore and find something awesome. And what Melon doesn't know is I am gonna find something awesome. His secret base. It's around here somewhere. I just gotta sniff it out. It's gotta be one of these blocks. He was over here somewhere. Yes, I found it. And then we climb down. <laughs> what does he have in here? Wait, what the heck? He's got high-tech security. Dude, he's got laser beams and a keypad door. Password, enter. Uh, that's not it. Uh, 4321, no. Uh, 069, no. 69, what the heck is this code? That's it. I'm gonna go talk to Quandale. See if he has any code breakers for sale. And for those of you who don't know Quandale, he's the traveling merchant villager. He always sets up his shop near our house because we give him the best deals ever. We kind of rip ourselves off and overpay him. But then sometimes we get revenge by dropping TNT on him. Oh, Quandale, I need a code breaker. Do you have any for sale? I found Melon's secret base, but I can't get inside. Wait, what? You have something better than a code breaker? Are you serious? You found the infinity gauntlet from Thanos and the stones to go with it? Wait, I could borrow it if I just craft it? Let's go! Okay, he's got it around here somewhere. It's in one of these chests. Okay, first try. I'm the goat. Now, where are the stones for it, though? Let's see. Infinity stones. Those are sponges. There's got to be infinity stones here somewhere. Bro, where are you hiding the stones? You got wandermelons? Dude, I don't need watermelons. I need infinity stones. Come on. Yo, he's got them all in this barrel. Soul gem, power gem, mind gem, time gem, space, and reality. Yo, this is so cool. Then how do I craft this? Is there a crafting table somewhere in here? Eh, that's fine. I'll just chop this tree. Make my own crafting table. And let's see if I just surround it with all the gems. It worked! Look at this thing! It's crazy! In my hand, I contained so much power! But with great power comes great responsibility, and I don't want to take advantage of it too much. But I will test it out on these cows. Boom! <laughs> Yo! 
I destroyed them. I lit this entire thing on fire. Let me actually get rid of these flames before I burn the whole world. Wait, what the heck was that? Bro, that was so loud. Sonny, what is going on? What is go- Where are all the cows? Bad news. I stood under the cows and I did that rain and thunder song dance. You know what I mean? And then boom, they all got struck by lightning. Bro, lightning killed all of our cows. That's it. I'm coming down there, bro. We're going to run out of roast beef. No, we got lots, dude. We got lots. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, bro. I've got just the thing. I got I got to get more wood, Sonny. I'll be right back. I'll repair the fence. You chill. Guys, I will actually fix this fence really fast so that Melon doesn't get too sussy. And actually, look at my health. The Infinity Gauntlet almost killed me. But that's okay. I could heal up using it. Let's go. Mind gem. And now I'll have full health again. Let's fix this up. And now we'll just need to herd some fresh cows. Over here. Let's go, Betsy. Over here. In you go. Come on now. Perfect. Here, enjoy. Melon, bro, where'd you go? Where are you, dude? Uh, I'm, um, uh, getting wheat for the cows. I'm, I'm out traveling. Why are you being so sus? That's it, guys. Using the infinity gauntlet. Freeze time! Go! Now I could sneak up on Melon because I'm pretty suspicious of him. I think he's down in his secret bunker again. He is! Look at him down here! And now I go down into his base. Here it is. Let's go! And I need a spot to hide. Infinity gauntlet. Turn these into ghost blocks. It worked! Just go inside of them and Melon will have no idea. Unfreeze time! now and six nine six nine and enter okay guys i made it past melon's security doors but i kind of want to unfreeze time here so that he disables his security system i just gotta hope he doesn't see me that's it ghost blocks go it worked okay okay he won't see me in here now i just unfreeze the time again and scan my retinals and just like that the security's down freeze yes it worked Melon deactivated his security system, and I froze time. Now I just sneak on by, and what is this? Guys, this is so annoying. Melon has another secret base that he hasn't told me about. That's it. I'm getting my revenge for this. He keeps taking all of our valuables, our gold, our diamonds, and what else is in these chests? Netherite? Are you kidding? And then he hogs it all for himself? That's it. I am going to prank him for this. I'm going to stand in this corner, unfreeze time, and when he comes to look in his chest, I'm going to make his items disappear. And unfreeze. Guys, I need to grab some nether right quickly here we go freeze yes he's in his chest and now i'm gonna taunt him so badly all of this is now mine <laughs> and i should probably turn these into ghost blocks to be safe so let's go ghost block ghost block ghost block perfect it worked and now i hide it here unfreeze yeah and what happened to all my netherite what it's all gone i have six in my inventory at least but it's all gone is the other chest okay Yes, they're fine. Freeze! He thinks his other chests are safe. Give me this! All of his iron now belongs to Sunny Incorporated. And gold? This is mine! You don't take the gold that's Sunny's! Diamonds? You know what? I am actually going to take all of these, and then I'm going to do this. L. Melon can enjoy his L. And now I go back into my hiding spot, and unfreeze! Wait, what happened to all the gold? Please tell me the diamonds. Why is it in the shape of an L? You know what? I'll take it. Just give me all the diamonds. These chests aren't safe. Something weird is happening, bro. Can anyone get in here? Hello? Hello? Freeze. Guys, I'm gonna do the greatest prank ever to Melon. Look at his precious little security area. I am gonna transform these sea lanterns into the ultimate prank. Hey, can this infinity gauntlet like, give me creative mode? It can! Let's go! And now I just gotta punch a few of these out. Yeah, that should be enough. Let's just put a couple like that and maybe some under there. And I think you know where this is going. I need some TNT. And we'll mix it up. We'll use some normal TNT and some 5X. Right about here. Then I just need to get myself a secret pressure plate like this. And blend it in so he thinks it's his normal sea lanterns. Then I remove this, place that back. And everything looks normal. Now I actually need a safer place to hide. I think this gold might get destroyed. So I'm gonna chill out in these diamonds. And turn them into ghost blocks! It worked! Yes, 
Yes. And three, two, one, unfreeze. Well, at least I have my diamond blocks and my gold blocks and all that. I just gotta go back and grab some tools to farm them. Wait, what? What was that sound? What was that sound? I gotta get out. I gotta get out. Wait, Sonny, freeze. Guys, I gotta go. Melon just saw me, but I gotta convince him that he was just seeing things. So, uh, uh, crafting table like this. Yeah, this is good. This is good. This is good. This will be fine. This will be fine. One diamond block. And I just put it uh, right there. And then I run away. And then I uh, go down here and turn these into ghost blocks. It worked. Go inside and uh, unfreeze. Wait, what? I swear that was Sunny right there. Am I going crazy? What is happening? I gotta get out of here. I just gotta get out of here. Freeze. I can't let Melon escape. I can't let Melon escape. Where is he? Where is he? That's it. Activate creative. There he is. <laughs> Look at this innocent little Melon. And now I'm gonna dig him into a treacherous pit. Oh, didn't mean to punch him. <laughs> He'll probably feel that when he wakes up. This is probably deep enough. Yeah, that looks about right. Then I'm gonna come up here and I'm gonna make some more ghost blocks right about here. Perfect. And unfreeze. Ow, what hit me? And where am I? Why am I in a hole? Bruh, I have no blocks. I literally cannot get out of here. Guys, I feel kind of bad for Melon. He has no way out. So let me bless him up real quick. Wait, where do these blocks come from? You know what? I'm not gonna question. I'm just gonna dig out of here now. Or build out of here. Yeah, so you think. Freeze! <laughs> Look at this. Look at this little Melon. And I activate creative. And let's just destroy all of this. And I want to time this last block up perfectly. Go Go here, come out a little bit, and three, two, one, unfreeze! Ow! What just happened? I oh my, I'm back where I started. Are you kidding me? What is going on? Freeze! And now I grab a little lava bucket, and I pour it right here. Unfreeze! Oh, I just gotta- Ah! Ah! What is going on? I've lost everything. Hey, Melon, how's your day going, bro? Sonny, why are you over there? I was just exploring, and I cut some trees down, did a little bit of adventure. It was you, wasn't it? I'm gonna kill you! First of all, I don't know what you're talking about. Second of all, freeze! <laughs> yes, I'm a villain. Melon is frozen in time, but he still sinks in the water. He's gonna drown, bro. I'm gonna unfreeze the time and be behind him. And then he'll be drowning. This is so good. This is so good. Yes. Look at him. He's actually taking damage. Wait for it. Wait for it. Unfreeze. Yo, what's going on? I'm gonna drown. Oh, oh, oh. I barely survived. Wait, where did Sunny go? And what was that second thing he was gonna tell me? Melon, I'm right behind you, dude. What's going on? Are you okay? What is going on? You were just here. You were just here and you were going to tell me something. I think you're going insane. I was just going to tell you I got a lot of beef. I even found a little lava moat and I went to the nether and I got some ingots. Dude, that is cat. Wait, you have netherite? Only one piece. What the heck? Okay, that's actually pretty reasonable. Did you, did you not hear those explosives go off earlier? Explosives, bro? I don't know what you're talking about. I was in the forest and then at the house. I spoke to Quandale. That was the biggest part of my adventure today. Okay. All right. I don't know what's going on, but nothing weird has happened in the past two days. I'm just going to go trade with some villagers. Hey, zombies, I would appreciate it if you left me alone. Please leave me alone. Where are the villagers? Where are the villagers? Yo, guys, I'm spying on Melon, and he's got zombies after him. Why are there so many zombies? Check this out. Freeze time. Oh, Melon's done. Unless this iron golem saves him. He's so dead. Oh, wait. No, the zombies. Why are they turning on me? I'm all the way at the top of this tower. This is not what I signed up for. Melon should be the one dying. This iron golem actually saved his life. That's it. I've got to stop this. I've got to stop this golem. And Mr. Iron Golem, why don't you taste my infinity gauntlet? Absolutely obliterated. One shot. And now I bring the zombies to Melon. Come here, little zombies. Yes, follow me. I have a tasty treat. It's juicy, nutritious, and delicious. He's right here. And then I go creative. I want to target him. Target him. Yes. 
And guys, watch this. Unfreeze! What's happening? They're right on me! I'm so low! I'm one shot! Wait, Sunny? Was that you? Was that you, Sonny? Are you okay? Melon, are you okay? Bro, help me. Please, the zombies, they're on me. Okay, I got you, bro. I'm the hero. Thank you, Sonny. That was so close. No problem, Melon. I got your back. I spawned these in using the infinity gauntlet. Melon is so finished. Check this out. Unfreeze. Yo, wait, what's going on? Why are they? What are those things? What's happening? Sonny, what's in your hand? What are you holding? Uh, a lava bucket. I'm holding a lava bucket. Run, bro. Uh, bro. What the heck? Ow. Ow, I can't fight back. I cannot fight back. Oh, no. Oh, no. Swim. Swim away. Swim away. Just swim, Melon. Just swim. I can make it. I can make it. They're slow. Hey, look at you, little puffer. Ow. That is no. That's a mean puffer fish. Oh. Oh, guys, I barely made it through the night. Now I can trade with some villagers. Also, Sonny, you're mega sus, bro. You had something really weird in your hands. What, that axe? Oh my Sonny. Yo, I'm gonna trade with the villagers. Hey, guys, what would you give me for Big Man Melon's head? Yeah? You'd give me all the emeralds? Amazing. Here you go. Here you go. All right, time to do some trading. Take my two stack of emeralds. Look at me. I have emeralds. Look at me. Yes, the trade was successful. What the heck is this gilded quartz pickaxe? Bro, this thing's insane. It's time to mine diamonds. Guys, I've been following Melon around all day waiting for my opportunity. He's been trying to find diamonds, and I think he's finally got one. Yo, guys. I finally found diamonds. There's diamonds there and diamonds right up there. Let's go. Let's go. Freeze. <laughs> he thought he was going to get these diamonds. Dude, as if. You thought, Melon. You thought. I've got something nice and spicy for you. I'll just replace one. And then if he's really stupid and survives, I'm going to put these over here and make them look super sus. Dang it. What did I do? What did I do? Okay. Nothing to see here. Time is still frozen. Melon has no clue. It's fine. It's all going to be okay. As I was saying, super sus. I, I would say these two do look super sus. And then I'll put a third one like that and a fourth one like that. Come back. And unfreeze. Yo. Wait, there's diamonds over there too. Hold on. Let me just grab these ones first. Here we go. What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> he survived it somehow. Bro, these diamonds look so sus over here. Okay. I'm going to be very careful when I mine these. Please don't tell me that. Bro, are all these explosive? Okay, I'm going to die. I'm actually going to die. Ooh, that was close. Melon almost saw me. <gasps> Freeze. Okay, guys. Melon is making a getaway. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to prank this entire area with lots and lots of mines. Yes, this should do the trick. If he survives this, he's actually goat mode. And then I'm going to go up here and unfreeze. Yo. Oh, okay. Thank God I made it out of here. Someone's out to get me, bro. I ain't gonna mine anymore. Oh, it worked. <laughs> he thought he was gonna survive. He exploded and got kicked from the server. All right, guys, I see Sonny. He's upstairs doing something weird. Look at him. Look how sus he looks. Guys, I know he's been pranking me recently, but I have no idea how he's doing it. That's it. I'm gonna lay a trap for him, okay? Stay right up there, Sonny. And... I'm just gonna go right here, dig down, dig this real deep. Then I'm gonna place a ghost block. Then he'll fall right in. It'll get him to confess to his pranks. Yo, Sonny, bro. Let's go get some wood again. We're running low on fuel. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's do that. I was just taking a nap, dude. I was super tired. Uh, just stay out of my chest, please. Don't touch my stuff. Of course, of course. All right, follow me, Sonny. We really got to mind. We're, like, behind schedule right now. Yo, Melon, what's the hurry, bro? Chill! Yo! <laughs> hey, Sonny. I know you've been pranking me recently. Yeah, you do? What do you know about it then? Listen here, Sonny. For every question you don't answer, I'm gonna drop a gravel on you! Relax! I haven't even been asked a question yet! Don't drop gravel on my head! Uh, Melon, that doesn't look like gravel in your hand. I won't drop a gravel next. <laughs> so, how have you been pranking me, Sonny? What have you been doing? Okay, you're 
You're not gonna believe this, I know how crazy it sounds, but I have this infinity gauntlet from Thanos that allows me to freeze time. Look, check it out. Freeze! It worked! Yo, that was so close! That anvil almost landed on my head. Now, I've just gotta switch to creative mode. And dig my way out of here, and then swap places with Melon. This is good. And then we cover it all back up. And now I just push Melon in. Come on, come on. Yes! And then put him under the anvil. Oh, yes, he's gonna be so mad. And then I just gotta build my way out of here a little bit and make it look not suspicious at all. Unfreeze! Yo! What just happened? I told you you wouldn't believe it, bro. I got a Thanos Infinity Gauntlet that lets me freeze time. Bro. Did you freeze time and switch places with me? I did. I could also kill you in one hit and strike you with lightning. Yow! Sonny the Gauntlet has too much power. You gotta destroy it before the power consumes you. You're right, bro. Even Quandale couldn't control this gauntlet. Uh, get rid of it! Uh, achoo! Uh, Melon? <laughs> that was fake lava, Sonny. Wait! Are you kidding me? Quickly, guys! Like and subscribe before Melon kills me! And you better click the next video on screen! Ow! Ow! Ow!